Hello. Hey, everybody. Dude, that's when he undefined. Hello. <laughs> Hello. 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 Fucking Hello. Stuff. Hello. Gamers. We're here. Why is that? It's been a while. Been it has been a while, been but a while. Uh, welcome to Dungeon Select, everybody. Oh, do I not get like a uh, like a fat bussy Davian edit for my? No, I right, make one. Okay. Make oh, one. Uh, don't right. I don't have yeah. the one, art. Yeah, I'm right not now. home. I'm pulling up Photoshop right now. <laughs> He's gonna oh, on the boy. fly. Um, but we're here. Welcome to Dungeon Select, everybody. We uh, we've been away for a little while because of uh, just. Fucking Easter. busyness and Easter and, and me being sick the week before and, and whatever. But we're here! Uh, and we're, we're getting back into it with a pretty fucking important uh, session. Because uh, mm -hmm. there's some shit going down today. So it's gonna be it's gonna be a fucking good one. We're all rusty as fuck, but uh, what better than a nice, important boss fight type beat to uh, get us back into the swing of things, right? Mm -hmm. um, sure. Thanks for all the subs and stuff, guys. Appreciate it. We've got a hype train, dude. All aboard the Poggers Express. Yeehaw. Um, stop getting hey, sick. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll make notes of that. Shatter. Thank yeah, much being sick. Write it down. <laughs> dude, Koiba. Yeah, you got COVID after like avoiding it for so long, yeah. dude. My man. Here he is. I've been public facing and like <laughs> in retail. Didn't get COVID. Fucking test positive yesterday. This is your first time? Yep. My boy. My first boy. time. <laughs> Long time listener, first time COVID have. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Um, before we get into it, does anybody have any announcements to make and whatnot? Yeah. Uh, got two announcements. One, this week on, I want to say Wednesday. I've forgotten yes. what number day Wednesday. it is. Yes, Wednesday. Wednesday. Um, Ethan and I, and probably a few other people joined in during the course that we're going to be doing a really long uh, stream because it's Blood Hunt release day. And we're super excited. So I, at least myself, I'm doing like an eight hour stream minimum that day. We're going to see how long we can go. And yeah, new game, new, lots of hype, going to be a good oh, yeah. time. And then by next week, so it was next Sunday is May 1st. Um, I will be, for the first time, been doing Twitch for five years, but never done St. Jude Play Live. Finally going to do it this year yeah. with my side quest <laughs> team. And one of my incentives is D&D &D related. If we hit my goal, I will stream from start to finish as the DM, a Call of the Nether Deep full campaign on my on my channel. And there's gonna be a mix of players. I'm gonna obviously see who maybe get a few players from the Dungeon Select fam, but then maybe a few new faces. And if we raise even more money, I might have a chat incentive where I let chat vote on two of the players and keep it a surprise until the reveal, like who gets picked. It's gonna be fun. So yeah, starting next week, that's gonna happen. <clears throat> Hell yeah, that's fucking awesome. Um. I, I kind of sort of dude i'm pissed right blood hunt super <laughs> hyped for that game but the day that comes out is king's day so i'm just gonna get fucking drunk all day and not be able to play on launch day it's gonna kind of it's kind of sad well but, there, you know. it's out though forever True. so you can play yeah, yeah lots you know afterwards. you know it. well we all know how launch days go for us dutch so that is true if yeah um, my track record with duke when it comes to like launch days of like new seasons in apex or whatever game we play sea thieves it's always a fucking mess dude things break yep. the game yep. doesn't oh, yeah. work half the Fair. time Maybe it's a may, yeah, maybe it's a good thing that I won't be playing on launch day. But uh, we'll yeah, I'll be out. I'll be getting fucking crunk on King's Day, and I'm gonna get some friends over. So Thursday might not be a discourse because I'll have friends over all day and shit, like the day after King's Day and all that shit. So you know, but um, it is what it is. Um, <clears throat> as far as streaming goes, I haven't really streamed much lately. Uh, it's just been super fucking busy. Uh, the, the IRL kind of taking it. I'm kind of taking a step back from streaming as a whole. Purely because I'm just super busy. Like, I'm going to step away from having a schedule. I'm just going to stream whenever the fuck I feel like I have time and the mood for it kind of thing. And the only, like, scheduled things I have throughout the week will be DS-related stuff. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm excited to be back for, for DS. Mm -hmm. It's been a while. Uh, I'm going to be rusty as fuck. Uh, forgot all the voices of the characters that you guys are going to be interacting with. So, you know, whatever, dude. Uh, it'll, it'll, it'll be fine. Um... Other than that, I don't really got anything else to say. Does anyone else here feel the need to pipe up about anything? Uh, I'll be home in just under two weeks, and then I guess I'll be hustling to get all the freaking audio-only ones up on Spotify, so that'll be fun. I mean, there's no no pressure. No pressure. Um, so I should be here for next week's session as well. 
Beautiful. Awesome. Uh, yeah. I'm not really doing anything about it, but it's my five years of streaming on May 9th. Nice. Exciting. So I might do like a, a long, stupid stream, but I haven't decided what I'm going to play yet. Instead of your normal stupid streams, it's just a long one. I mean, look, there's one of two things going to happen. <laughs> Either I'm going to be like <laughs> memes and play Roblox on Minecraft. Stop. Why or would you, why would you do that? I'm gonna Please plan do. to play literally anything else and then cancel it to play Blood Hunt. But just play Blood Hunt on the stream then. What? Play Blood Hunt in Roblox. <laughs> Can oh chat my, have oh my god, yes! Can chat have announcements? Sure, Shatter. What's up, buddy? What do you want to share? You yeah. have that because badge. Fat, dumpy, you're, you're, you can share. <laughs> everyone, everyone hold your breath. <laughs> well, Shadow replies with his announcement. Maybe that can be our first like subscriber perk for channel subscribers. You're allowed to contribute during announcement <laughs> time. Well, you can highlight a message. True. 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 Just delete. <laughs> oh, this is <laughs> the Mario Kart for your for your stream, that's, Ethan. That's a really good Sassy announcement, James. Good one. Oh, well, that's an excellent announcement. <clears throat> It's waiting for Shatter to pipe up, but uh, here we are, dude. You know, take his arm, Shatter. Do not derailing us at all. Oh, there we go. He's streaming in a costume. Raven Week? Woo. That's a thing? What does that mean? What is Raven Week? Like what? Side note, I weeks? thought you were talking about like Raven as in... <laughs> Fucking that's so Raven. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. so, I thought you meant Raven Teen Titans. Titans. Yeah, 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 I was going that yeah. direction. No, I thought you meant the Scottish CBBC uh, TV <laughs> oh show, Raven. Um, a challenge. <laughs> Begin. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> all right, dude. All right, man. Fuck. Uh, fuck. Memory uh, unlocked. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's get into the swing of things, shall we? Shall we? Um... <clears throat> Fuck. Last we left off, you guys made it to Lake Udina and met up with some uh, Triton there. Um, you, you've met up with, with Fairy, the healer of the Triton community, the one who's kind of your biggest ally in said community right now, allowing you ally. to kind of... Um... Excuse me? <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> Uh, it's just a really stupid TikTok, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh no. Okay. Ruined. All right. Your biggest ally in uh, in this in this in this tribe, this community of, of Triton. Um learned a lot about certain things. Uh Kess learned a thing or two about a certain affliction that may or not may or may not be <clears throat> plaguing uh, dear old dad, and um, yeah, we'll see. We'll, we'll see where that goes when the time comes. I'm not gonna get too in depth on that front because really, all you know is that it's some kind of hered hereditary word, right? Hereditary, yeah, pretty hereditary. Close. That's the one. Uh, yeah. Condition in in air elementals, which means that there is a potential because Kess is half that. Um, uh, that, 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 that resides in Kess 2 in some dormant form, but we don't know. Um, <clears throat> other than that, obviously, the uh, hunt for the Tears of Kasuth is something that has been going on since pretty much the beginning of the campaign. It's looking like uh, it's going to come to an end today. All that stands between the party and that final tier is a very large monster that lives King under the monster. water that happens to be <gasps> Estitia's pet. Yeah, it also happens to have some kind of influence us. on the important figures in the town that may be the reason why some of the Triton are a bit uh, dickish. Is it Nessie? Yes. Are you negative dog? Yes, it is. Uh, with that said, you all uh, had your rest you went to bed early because uh, you're meant to meet up with fairy uh, very early before sunrise to uh, be escorted by her to the outskirts of the kind of the like triton territory um, to find uh, ingredients medicine and that sort of thing um, or at least that's what they lead the the, the the tribe to believe but in reality 
you're gonna go find yourselves a beastie to kill. So with that said, I forgot what you all decided on, whether you slept underwater or... We, we all slept underwater, yeah. Yeah, okay. we did. <clears throat> all right. Uh, I turned Onu into an octopus, and then we all slept yeah. underwater. You did, you did, you did. So, with that said, I'm gonna change up the music to something a little more, a little more dramatic. There we go. Oh, I can listen along. What do you want to do? As you mm. all slowly wake up. Underwater. I will quickly do some prayers to Joaquin to change my spell list. Scooby I will look at the group. As everyone's half awake. And not entirely with it yet. <laughs> look, I... Don't necessarily understand why everyone is so involved in the way that I've acted, but I can at least understand that it caused some tension, so I will endeavor to be less reckless around you all. Oh, you said do. that you're not going to blow yourself up. up. I can see he's going to try not to put himself up as much. Oh, he's well. He's still going to do it. Which, to be fair, I'll take the win at this point. <laughs> it was such a hardship. No, because if I was trying not to do it, I just wouldn't do it. If someone else blew me up, that's out of my head. Yeah, but that's different. Anyway, regardless, problem solved. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Okay. Uh, you know what I'll take it at this point. Oh, uh, also at that, some point last it? night, who who has the bag of holding? Who carries it in our group? Yeah, Jax. 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 Okay. At some point last night, um, I realized now because over the break I wrote like a journal entry in there, related things. I was like, can't really write that underwater. So because I put my journal in the bag of holding, maybe at one point I would have gone up, just asked Jax for it back, and gone up and like written it on dry land, and then came back and like sure. put it in there. Yeah, sure. So. Just saying that happened, but yeah. Well, and I, I also probably look cranky and maybe have bags under my eyes because I didn't sleep very well because I can't sleep with my plushie underwater. It's in the bag of holding. Oh, <laughs> oh <I'm> no! <laughs> in so my sad. head, somehow Diagon always looks kind of angry. Well, I do. I have resting bitch face to the end yeah. degree, but now there's like extra dark circles. And now it looks less angry and more like pouting kid. I'm just mad. Diagon, do you want to buy breakfast this morning? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yeah. All right, so Ooh. if I'm correct, then in that case, you slept inside uh, the clinic, right? The um, mm -hmm. yes, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. So it's a clinic, and that's probably the best word to describe, um, you know, the, the, the sort of kind of private practice type hospital that they have down there. Yeah, we just crashed in the waiting room, like, no, you just got given like there's a bunch of like free rooms and stuff, um, for patients that I guess would have longer illnesses yeah. and would have to stay there, so. And the patients are all on the floor. Ah, that's just no patients. <laughs> well, I forgot the name of the... What was the name of the healer? Fairy. F-E-R-Y-I. Fairy. Uh, right. Well, um, I suppose we should find Fairy and get out where we're going. She said we'd have to leave fairly early, so... Mm -hmm. I'm, I'll go get my dad when we're swimming across for the distraction. Oh, I right. I think we still need a distraction, do we? I thought this was also mm. it was just in case. I thought we could just. Yeah, it was just going. in case so that they were distracted for longer. Well, <laughs> right, but general. we're already we sort of sneaking out. So we're True. Sort of well, not sneaking out. We're going out under yeah. false Pretense. pretenses, Pretense. but but at least it's believable. You know, we're just going to go pick water flowers or something. Exactly. <laughs> water flowers? Well. I think they're just flowers. I don't think it makes a difference if they're underwater or not. Of course it does, otherwise they'd just call it weed and not seaweed. You got me there. I hate, hate that he makes sense. Yeah, same. Kinda hate that. But isn't that just the name of the plant? Just, it's like... Oh uh, no, like I'm sure thing. it's got some long... fancy... Elven name, Sylvan, probably. Sylvan <clears throat> name, something like that. Or, but, uh... 
I don't know. It, it, we're, we're not in the sea anyway, we're in a lake. But I don't know if it's... Well, they call lake it pond weed, weed, pond weed, so maybe it is lake weed. <laughs> out, of, out of character, lake weed is a thing. So you like lake weed versus seaweed for like it. I, I hear it's a, it does a, very, a, a very mellow high. <laughs> oh, we are for four days off, lads. Damn. Oh, no. <laughs> what? Huh? Hmm? <laughs> Jackson just been like listening to this conversation, just like. <laughs> Jack just done every kind of drug, let's be real, too. <laughs> Does it just take know, people with the arthritis? Pirates, dude. I don't know if it's drugs, but they, they, they know how to drink. That's what I'm sure. That plus his long years of life, he's had ample opportunity. To just I was going to say, he takes it as a pain medication. This point's fucking arthritis or some shit. Oh, I see, you know, since they legalized it in the Empire. <laughs> <laughs> I, take it, I take it medicinally. Oh, medicinally no. I remember it's when it's the first dispensary the started taking <laughs> Electrum. Oh, God. Electrum was the only thing you could spend at a dispensary. You just can't I smoked the Electrum. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm going to uh, I'm going to put my head my electrum under bomb? Board, whatever we're in, and just see if Faye's out there. I guess because I imagine she's not far. Um, I mean the like the hallway and and like the waiting room and stuff. It's all empty as hell. It's super dark. Um, but uh, you hear some shuffling coming from down the hall to where her uh, her little like office is, where you've had a talk with her before. So, do we have to like swim places? No, um, it's. I feel it's like would be weirdly funky. buoyant with the you, bubble. You're able to walk, but it's almost like a very. Um, it's a weird. It's a weird experience. It's you're able to walk, but it's definitely. Uh, floaty yeah. i feel like very almost like a like a like a like a Baseball. like a low gravity type experience almost where yeah like you you hop a little further and kind of like pushing myself off the freaking walls and stuff and ceiling yeah but yeah so i'll go i'll go to uh faye faye's office i guess you can't really knock Get little, the seat. Uh, impromptu. Get... she's got like a we uh curtain of like help yeah <laughs> That you guys kind of just like decided that was there, and I was like, okay, yeah, sure. Is that Give it a little, little <laughs> jingle. I'm Every house through. in like the the mid two thousands that had like the bead curtains. Oh, that's yep. that's like an eighties thing, wasn't it? Sixty. Maybe I just lived in a really shitty neighborhood where no one updated them. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, that sounds more. Accurate. I could. I I, I could believe that. Yeah. I could believe that. Yeah, um, it was hip forty years ago, but. Right, so I'll, I'll poke my head into a fairy's office and uh... Yeah, you can so, see, see what's she's going on. Um, shuffling around. She has like a pouch uh, like uh, on her side now and, and she's she's putting some like supplies some like supplies in it, some small like blades and, and whatnot. And uh, she kind of notices <clears> you <throat> pop your head in and it's like Morning. Uh, we're just about getting ready, so whenever you're uh, ready yeah, to set off we'll um, follow along. Uh, the final supplies I need, and uh, we'll be good to go. Just, um, is everybody awake? Uh, yeah. Just sort of still rubbing the sleep from their eyes, but yeah, we're we're ready to go. Very good, very good. Okay, um, for the purposes of this, um, we're going to be going to, um, a reef. Um, towards the more deeper part of the lake, uh, more towards the, the center. Um, there will be guards on our way out of the town. Um, you know, as soon as I say that that you're with me, and I'm showing you, you know, you're, you're learning, you're studying our, our medicinal practices. Um, they should back off, but just uh, just in case they ask you some more questions, just um, just just tell them that um, you know, you know, the best lies are always lies that are partially true. So tell them that you're from. Your capital city, which, uh, the, the, the Eldilon, is it right? That's what, yes, uh, yeah. uh, what's, 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 what's Roderick mentioned. Um, just, um, tell, 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 you know, if they ask, tell them you're from there and, um, there's this affliction going around, uh, mostly hitting people that experience, you know, work in the water, the seafarers and whatnot, and you came here for, for guidance on, on how we treat some of our more water uh, centric uh, illnesses and whatnot, right? Right, yeah. Just 
going out, getting some nice herbs, helping you out. We always say it's as a, you know, sort of repayment for the for the place to stay. Exactly. All right. Very good. Um, well, yeah, if, if you want to gather everyone, and then uh, we'll, we'll be good to go. All right. And I'll uh, drift my way out and back down to the, uh, to where everyone was sleeping. Uh, well, as soon as everyone's ready, phase good to go. A little bit, a little bit nervous, to be honest, but, you know, it'll be, it'll be all right. We'll be fine. Yeah, What's we'll never gone wrong for us? No, Does... Don't say that, no. Does Kess have any green spots? <laughs> <laughs> Make a perception check. <laughs> yeah, but it's just uh, a bit of um, food from the other day. It's in the teeth. Just... 11. Not as far as you can tell. Alright. No green spots on Kess. Good. <clears throat> Yet. Yet. <laughs> and I guess I will just... How does... How does a bow work on the water? <laughs> they don't. Um, that's a cool thing well. about it. The they range do, wouldn't it be but... the range gets very very shortened because they lose yeah. a lot of their power very quickly because of the water resistance. The way oh, even my magic out. works is um, a ranged weapon attack automatically misses a target beyond the weapon's normal range. So the first uh, like range, yeah, get. which is uh, huge on a longbow anyway. And within normal range, it's a roll with disadvantage. That kind of sucks, but okay. Uh, unless it's will, a crossbow, uh, net, or a weapon that's thrown like a javelin, so like a spear or a dart or a trident. Because I guess those like cut through the water, right? Because you don't like... Yeah. So a normal, like uh, a we longbow in that case will be disadvantage, unfortunately. That's fine. It's got a range of 150, so I can deal with disadvantage. But uh, yeah, I'll scoop up little octopus um, <coughs> oh, yeah. Onu. And like, I guess he's kind of I put him onto my shoulder, and he kind of wraps his tentacles under my arm, but he's hanging on, and, um... Are you still little, or is he still gonna be, like, a fucking, like, big, like, almost giant squid, like... He's, he's uh, I'm just, pretty just a size, right, I'm pretty sure? Yeah, but not... Pretty fucking like, big for octopus. Say, yeah, <laughs> octopuses don't get huge, but he's gonna be... He's, they can. He's decently sized, but... You know, it's a big boy. <laughs> uh, actually, uh, the, the, it should say right in the stat block for uh, what, what is it, C creature of water or whatever the fuck it's called, beast of the water. It should say size, right? Uh, I think it's medium for everything. Yeah. Which so it's just it for, for octopus. octopus. <laughs> pretty yeah, big, it'd be yeah. huge. It'd be fucking huge. Because octopi, Let me see. is it octopi? Octopuses? Octopi? Octopodes. Octopodes. They are, technically, yeah. They're top. They're the degree small beasts, but because Onu is not a normal octopus, uh, it'll be whatever size the like ranger thingy says it is. So if it's medium, then it's medium. Yeah, I'm, <clears> I'm <throat> looking in Tasha's cauldron right now. Uh, Beastmaster companions. It is. Yeah, it's a medium beast. There you go. So, so a large octopus. It occupies a yeah. five by five foot space, which five foot fucking octopus. Okay, fine. He's he's like a backpack. Okay. That's amazing. Just like, just like, the, like, like around my front. The fucking yeah. uh, suction You guys ever things. played um, Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass? The fucking main villain in that? It's like a big octopus. It's like that. I don't I actually, I don't remember. I have played it, I have played it but I don't remember. Seldom. Excellent reference. <clears throat> Thank you. Um, all right, so you all kind of gather uh, in the... Um, you'll, you'll meet Fairy in the, you know, the entry hall slash waiting room. And she uh, looks at you all. Are we all ready? Very good, very good. Um, as we'll ever be. Where we're going, it's about, uh, it's about a half hour march, swim, whichever mode of transportation you prefer down here. Um, shouldn't really matter that much. Um, it's about 30 minutes. Uh, from then on, I'll give you directions of where to go, but um, I have a sense that it's all a little bit pretty obvious where you're supposed to go. Excellent. <clears throat> Well, I suppose you lead the way, and if we get stopped, we'll do our best to seem innocent. Sounds good. All right, uh, and she uh, leaves the door and just waits for you all to um, get outside, and you can look around, and there's barely any movement. It is very early in the morning. You can It's still very dark. You look up to, like, the, the surface uh, of the water, and there's, there's no lights from any sun or anything. Like, there's a bit of moonlight that kind of shimmers, but it's not, not nearly enough to reach very deep and light up the streets like it did, like it does during daytime. Um, or like the sun does during daytime, I should say. 
you um, follow her to the edge of town, and there's a couple of guards that kind of look at you all, and um, seeing Fairy, they kind of ease up a little bit and kind of look at you all. So, um, what was it you're learning exactly? We're, um, <clears throat> we're learning about a cure for, or a treatment for a, an illness that's going around Eldalon to do with, like, seafarers. And well, people who go in the water it? a lot. What, what kind of illness? Like, what, what, what are the symptoms? Oh, it's nasty. You really come out with these, like, bright purple boils and... And then like a pox of some kind. Yeah, and then your tongue swells up really big, so you can't fit it in your mouth, and it's make a deception good. check with advantage, guess. Oh <laughs> 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 yeah, my deception is so good. Uh, twenty-four. I, I think I think my brother had that at one point in his life. Um, oh, it's treatable. I'm Tre so treatable. sorry. Treatable, treatable though, like you got you know the, the stuff we have down here is. Uh, it sounds the same and, and should do the trick. Uh, all right, good luck and uh, you know respect the lake and all that. Of course. The parks. And they uh, they they'll like you know they they kind of ease up and you guys pass and they they don't really look back at you. They just kind of mumble among themselves for a bit. But uh, this is very hard for you to hear. Um, <clears throat> fairy escorts you. And you get to, about half an hour later, you get to this, like, very pretty coral, like, kind of like a coral reef kind of thing. A bunch of different colors and uh, some of them quite sharp, so you gotta, gotta watch out when where you step and, and, you know, make sure that you don't, like, touch them because they will cut you open. Um, and among the, the reef here, there's a bunch of different flowers and, and shells that all kind of, like, decorate the... The, the the bottom of the lake over here and fairy will kind of just like look at you all. Alright, well um and she'll just point. If you just look there and you all look that way and you can see kind of the outline of this this volcano, this this mountainous um area <clears throat> in the distance. That'll be where you're headed. And this is will this will be as far as I go. I'll be waiting for you here, uh, for your for your return. If you're not back in, well, let's just say that I'll be here for a few hours, and if you're not back, then I'll assume the worst and make up some excuse as to why I lost you. Um, I'll just say that you swam up to the surface and, and left with the supplies you had or something. So it'll, it'll be fine. The, the, I I want to ask. The thing I'll say is it's quite rude of you not to say goodbye, but you know whatever. I want to ask Kess in sign language to ask Fairy, is it considered disrespectful to the lake if I took a seashell? Oh, Belle, you're, you're muted. Oh, mute. <laughs> Dagon wants to know if it's disrespectful to take a shell from the lake. Um. Well, yes and no. It depends. What for? Like a souvenir. Just because they're pretty. Because it's pretty. Sure. Okay, I want to just just do a quick like before we're standing. I'm not gonna like take a long time, but whatever look, whatever any seashell that jumps out, but also doesn't look too, like nothing that looks like if it's a large thing that might have like a something living in it, just one of the little little small uh, ones. You kind see of like thing. a small um, what are they called? Like these like very flat shells, like the clam shell kind of shape. Uh, ones? yeah, sure. Uh, very very <laughs> colorful. A bunch of different like colors from like red to purple to blue. Um, seems very smooth as well. Like almost like um, very smooth as in like like a shiny kind of kind of yep. hue to it. If you were to hold it in the light, so it's pretty cool. I'll put it in my pocket. Okay. <clears throat> right. Well, I uh, wish you all the best. See What's you later. the plan when we? Are you? You're not going to return to the town on your own, I assume. Me? Yeah. Well, depend. I'll be here for a few hours, and if you're not back by then, then I'm, I'll assume the worst, and I'll make up some excuse as to you had to suddenly go, and that's that, really. All right. Well, um, can I like 
somehow, well, you know, being being a ranger and stuff. Can I just like make a mental note of where we left Faye so we can make it back here easily? Like, if I, if I from this point say I'm gonna very deliberately make a point to to keep clo a close eye on like where we're going and make and a, make a survival check. Okay. <laughs> That's a 14. Yeah, you reckon you'll be able to kind of... Maybe not the exact point, but... The direction to get close enough to, to the point where you would see the reef and you'll be like, oh yeah. Okay, great. yeah. Because it's... It, yeah, I guess it's colorful and it's yeah. it's easy enough to find. Okay. Um, like, alright. How dark is it down here? Sorry? How dark is it down here? Uh, the moon... Uh, because you're now no longer obstructed by like the buildings and stuff in the in the town, the moonlight does like kind of shine and, and brighten up the area a little bit. I'd say probably dimly lit, if anything. Okay. Sure. Uh, I think. Well, since we're going separate ways, I'll sort of give give Faye a nod. Good luck, and hopefully we won't take too long. Yeah, um, the get the pray, volcano, I suppose, it's, pray for us, but... it's probably an hour there, an hour to just get there, so I'll keep that in mind. Um, I'll say that if you're not back in, like, four hours, I'll probably assume the worst. All right, four hours. If, um, well, if we take longer than that, but we make it out okay, I suppose our best bet is to just go up to the surface. Just go, rather than... yeah. Yeah, all right. Well, um, whether you, you know, say you succeed, then the influence on, 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 on Kuzos should fade and everything should kind of turn out all right anyway. But um, to be honest, I reckon if you're late, but you do succeed, just come to the town and, well, maybe you'll, oh. you know, the, 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 because of the, the control or the influence that Estesia and, and his, his, his beastie have, being gone, um... Yeah, I, I would actually consider that. You, uh, well, then, come regardless plus, of success. Uh, plus, if you, you know, say you bring your... And she looks at Kess, and say you bring your, 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 you know... Your family, I, sp I suppose. Um, I'm sure nothing bad will happen to you. True. That seems to be quite... In a way, be, being related to, to, to Dashu and, and, and them, uh, some kind of uh, diplomatic immunity, almost. <gasps> no, why would you say that? You well, we are done. diplomats, after all. Oh, oh no. you don't know what you've done here. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm diplomatically immune! Oh, In this yeah, one... you're not. Finally. I'll, I'll do that thing where like, I'm like, trying to like, cast it in the face, but that's how I'm like, in this one specific place and time. I should not have mentioned general. this fucking Eldalon. I'd be the No, fine. that's not how it works. I can do whatever it's I want. The, no, Kess, this isn't how oh, this works. Oh, this is it's, excellent. You can see like, as close as I can just get to like, a panic attack almost in like, just anger, just, like frustration. <laughs> just that like, no, it's, it's, like yeah, it's, it's that like, this is not the time or place, it's not the time or place. You know, like the weird anger management starts counting to 10. It's that like, not the time or place, not the time or place. He, he takes, he takes the, the bubble from his cap of water breathing and like puts it over his mouth and he's just like, just snapping a band against his wrist. Yeah, just say like, don't do it, don't do it, it's not worth it, not worth it, it's not worth it. Don't waste your time on things that need to be while, while, that, while he's doing that, I just go over and like pat a Lazarus on the shoulder, like awkwardly, like they're there. They're. It's, it's when, you, um, when you do that, I will uh, give you Vigilant Blessing. Oh, hey, cool. <laughs> there you go. It has to be touched, <laughs> so thank you, Doc. Like, while panicking, you're like, oh, wait, have this. Uh, no, I'm just there like, oh, shit, oh, thanks. <laughs> I'll help you out wait. later on. And we'll stall no longer. We've got an hour to walk. <clears throat> and hopefully... Not an hour of talking about diplomatic immunity. Well, there's nothing more to say. We've got Can it. Can I open a specific can of worms? Yeah. You don't know what you've done. So. <laughs> you don't know. It. But... <laughs> it's fine. We should, we should go more places. I'm immune to everything. Does your diplomatic immunity extend to poisons while you're in the in the town yeah that's you <clears throat> i'm going to sort of whisk onu 
off my back and just mm-hmm. sort of send him out. And he, like, bloop, bloop, bloops. You know how, how octopuses <laughs> swim up, you know, above us in the water, just kind of, you know, 30 feet or so up. Mm-hmm. And I'm just going to start walking in, in the direction that she uh, she sent us. Okay. Mm-hmm. I shall follow. All right, team. Let me quickly grab my notes. Uh, the closer and closer you get to the out, you know, the volcano, and after a little while, it, it becomes more than an out, than just an outline. It is it, just large, very, very, very large, just like mountain. Um, ever, you know, even though it's been underwater for so long. Still, the closer you get, you get this sense of, like, warmth that kind of gets more and more um, intense. Not to the point where it's, like, uh, holding. Not to the point where it's, like, interfering or, 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 or like, like being a, a problem, but it's, it definitely gets warmer and warmer the closer you get. So it seems that even though uh, the volcano has been submerged for so long, uh, some of Kasuth's just, like, fiery um, throne that once was the seat of flame um, still definitely still uh, has some of its magic intact and that, that kind of influences the temperature around it or like in the immediate surroundings at least um, Do I like sense anything on the, the tears as we get closer? Um Yes, you do. Uh, you definitely get a sense of direction. The, okay. It's kind of like similar as how you somehow knew that layout. And you had that dream of that layout of that maze. Yeah. You kind of get here and you've never been here before, but you just kind of know where to go. It's like your 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 instincts are guiding you and you, you walk slash swim with purpose. You know exactly where you have to be. And the closer mm-hmm. you get, the more and more intense that feeling gets. Uh, l- yeah, okay, okay. So, you know, after the first sort of 45 minutes or whatever of walking and general chit-chat, I sort of fall very quiet and determined as I, I'm just, I guess, following the sense of, of where we need to go. Kind of leading the way with Onu is still sort of maybe 10 feet ahead of me and 20 mm-hmm. feet up just kind of leading the way okay this sort um, of like <clears throat> like um death and going quite direct would have it been something that we noticed when we we're in the um the like labyrinth last time that he was very yeah. like mm, which way to I go was so. it yeah because i ended up stepping on traps and shit last time right yeah and I, I yeah know you just Kes, i know Cass definitely like verbally said something about it as well i think Elasrin noticed it but didn't say anything I'm pretty sure Kess like, kind of like called you out and like, have you been here before or yeah. some shit like that when that happened? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I did. But is, is it that same? Is it that same sort of look he's got on him that he's that would like very much close? so? Yeah. Okay, I will like, I'll just kind of keep an eye out on Davian to make sure he doesn't go fucking haywire. <laughs> well, he did last time, but just as a like, I'm is gonna stay close to Davian. Paying like, you know, taking any like particular interest in eyeing out the surroundings and looking around. Oh, um, yes. Okay. I'm focused on Damien. Brooks I haven't been for anything an like the thing us. I saw before. Sorry, uh, Belle? Uh, Kaz is looking out for anything like she saw before when she yeah, saw the saw that shadow or okay. something. Okay. Uh, Brooks? He's watching the rear. Okay. <clears throat> um, all of you make perception checks then. So, uh, Davian for, uh, for Onu, uh, Kaz and Brooks. Perception checks? Aye. Vrooks is helping on. Jax keep an eye on the rear. <laughs> uh, no. Dirty 20. <laughs> no, he's not. Okay. <laughs> Jax he's... is helping Vrooks keep an eye on the rear? Sure. I mean, it's a... Uh, when he plus says one like, instead of a plus four. <laughs> like, that was such an obvious I rolled shit, so I'm going to change it now. I no, didn't... Actually, fine. actually, I didn't roll yet. <laughs> I, I, um, I have now rolled, and it's not good. Okay. With advantage, six. Okay. Uh, the rear seems clear. Yay! <laughs> Great, we've all had enough fiber. Uh, Kes? 30-20. 
Um, keep that in mind. Um, what did Onu? Uh, Onu got get? eight. So, eight. so Onu. So it, it's a bit dark for his octopi. Yeah, and and <laughs> octopi. Um, oh and Onu, you know, it's the first time he's a water, he's an aquatic creature, so he's kind of still getting yeah. the hang of it and kind of focus on that. He's um, learning. Kes. Yes. Again, just as quick as it was last time you saw, you look towards the volcano. Uh, pretty much in the direction that you're like headed, it's like straight ahead of you. This very, very big shape. And you like blink and it's gone. Because like, as soon as she sees it, it's like slapping a arm. Yes, <laughs> like, what? What? Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you see it? See, uh, uh, do I see it? <laughs> uh, by the time you get warned, it's already gone. Uh, Hear, hearing the commotion, I'm just gonna turn back and be like, I remember being told that when we fight this thing, we need to avoid line of sight as much as possible. So, like, avoid, be, uh, avoid being directly in its line of sight, so keep oh, something okay. between you and it. Yeah, it was over there. That uh, I just look at Brooks and I like give a raise an eyebrow. Dagen. Yeah, a raise an eyebrow. I suppose I suppose Dagon could keep me between her and it, but yeah, I can't keep other people. Yeah, that works. We well, could be behind it. True. I feel like this is probably the sort of thing that doesn't really care whether you're in front or behind it, honestly. You said line mind of, you, vision. You said it's I, Listen, I, that's all I was told. I don't know if that's because it shoots shit out or it, because it has to look at you or what, but that's that's all I know. I, I'm really I sorry. I don't have any more grenades, so my, mail, my, my battle capabilities are hit things. Well, you're also the most... Axe things. The most, you know, you can bear... You can take the most punishment... No, don't right. say, don't say that because then he does stuff like blowing himself up. No, I well, swear, Brooks. Before we get this, I'm going to assume this thing has like a big sharp teeth or something. Do not just swim into its mouth to try and like attack it more because it would be cool. Okay, do not get yourself eaten because you think it would be cool. What if you went to the other end? Oh, that's stop fine. giving him ideas. No, stop. I'm. Just don't get eaten. Reckless and enjoy a spark of adrenaline. I'm not stupid. Mm, questionable. When you're high on adrenaline, are you sure it doesn't um, modify your intellectual capabilities? What would be fun about swimming into its mouth? There's no. I way... don't know what's fun about being blown up. <laughs> Have you experienced it? <laughs> Pretty close. <laughs> but not not exactly. No, but I think I'd end up like most lizard folk. A little bit over there, a little bit over there, and I'm not fucking over that way. Well, if you carry on fucking talking, that might be the most. <laughs> oh, hey, Alright, he's not going in his mouth. Just keep an eye out, please. <laughs> uh, at this point, I this is why I rolled me. badly. Because Brooks is giving, because Brooks gives sass, I'm gonna go up towards him a little bit more, and I'm just gonna cast eyes and night on everyone. <laughs> He's eyes and eye on everyone, including me. Brooks. Yeah. Hold on. Are you are you using holy magic to spite Brooks right now? <laughs> that is so petty. Why are we so petty? <laughs> okay, hear me out. Don't just say. Don't just say willing creatures. <laughs> no, you can share through dodge to. F oh, no, it does say willing creatures. Yeah, you're oh. fucked. Idiot. <laughs> Our group needs to be something with petty in it. This is lame. Lame. Just throwing holy water. Petty thieves. Well, I'm still really? gonna use it on every. I'm still gonna use eyes of night on everyone because it's pog as fog. Yeah, I mean, I could do some of that. I'm sure. Yeah. Uh, Wait, I, 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 only has that. Do you want to see a few hundred feet? Oh, actually, I'll give it to Onu. Fuck you, Brooks. <laughs> I'll give it to Onu. <laughs> Does Siren get any of that or? Oh shit, Siren's with us. <laughs> Tyrion just stood oh, there, oh, watching man. someone choose an octopus over her. What? Watching a Lazarin choose an octopus over her. Oh my god. Oh, no, hold on, hold no, on, it, hold on, hold on. Hang on, two... Yeah, I can still do it without like, Brooks. I can do it without Brooks. There's always just a spark of joy. Are you joy, including Jax? You want to have Jax as well! Oh god! It's been a while. 
<laughs> it's, wow. it's everyone oh. but Brooks Okay, I won't, I'll give it to Siren not to fucking Onu then. Okay. <laughs> no, no, go for it. I'm sure that'll help your relationship when you choose the octopus over her. No, you're Siren, because I fucking... I don't see them, so they don't exist in my brain. The Koiba brain, stupid, don't see, forget, okay? Koi brain. God, oh, <laughs> fuck <When> off. <laughs> <laughs> when you have the object permanence of a baby. I thought you put like a dog. Does that mean he's forgotten Davian's here shit? too? Because Duke's not on camera today? True. No, because I can see his Discord icon. Does <laughs> <laughs> so I count it? <laughs> You what? take Koiba's dice away and hide them behind your back, and he's convinced that they're in the room somewhere. <laughs> oh no, dude! Fuck! I don't see my dice bag. <laughs> <I'm> just... <laughs> like, oh. What's that all set? Right. <clears throat> uh, now that you all have how many feet of dark vision? Three hundred. Um, Davian is, 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 ahead, is leading the pack, right? So, Davian, can you just yeah. do a perception check, please? Skr Nobody go more than sixty feet away from me, oh. please, because you can twenty-two, me and I can't 22. see you. Twenty-two. You yes, look sir. towards the volcano and you see this large opening, kind of like in the bottom of it, and every sense that you possess is telling you, pleading with you to please go there. Okay, I mean, I won't say anything, but I'll shoot a straight course for the Volcusi. <laughs> I fucking hate you, and what I hate more is Koiba typed that, like... Split second before you said it. Yeah, no, I read. I just read it off of what Koiba wrote. Oh my god! <laughs> Hell yeah! Oh boy. Okay, I'm on one. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, so as I'll you follow. head for the. Uh, the okay. No, no, I'm, I, okay. I thought about it. Um, <laughs> um, you approach and, and you eventually you get to the, the foot of the volcano and you're standing right before the like entryway into this it's like cave almost that leads seemingly leads into the volcano. Every time you say volcano, I just assume you're gonna say the other word. <laughs> every That's time. On you. you condition yourself. To I know. know, I know it is, but every time. <laughs> the seat of flame or something. I think that's right. Seat of flame, yeah. Yeah. The seat of flame or something is is an interesting name. Sounds like a cool band. Seat of flame. So, Let's see them. well, okay, we're looking in. Mm -hmm. We're staring deep into the. Don't say it. Okay, no. Passage. <laughs> That's <laughs> almost worse. <laughs> is it? Is it? I mean, it's fucking dark. I guess. Yeah, but yeah, it's it's, it's yeah, dark, yeah, yeah, yeah. but um, you do see light kind of emanating from inside and you can see that there's some like crystals and, and things. Does it feel warm? Yeah. Very comfortably yeah. warm, actually. A warm breeze blowing out of there. Yeah, and just the water around the volcano as well. It's just like, it's, it's a comfortable mm. temperature. Very comfortable. And is it just a straight... Well, it's, it's, well how, how deep does this go? Like You have no idea. Okay, so it extends beyond the 200 feet or whatever of dim light that I can see. Yes. Yes. Okay. I mean, is it... What, is it... Worth lighting up the area a little bit, or do you think that's going to? Oh, I think we'd probably it? be better off not. Okay. But like I said, there are um, like crystals and stuff embedded in the walls of the cavern. Does that, that does the light? I mean, that does the entryway? Light. The entryway doesn't look man-made or anything, right? No, 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 no. If anything, uh, it looks like some kind of creature dug itself in there. Oh, that's even worse. Did can I? Can I check if some kind of creature dug itself in there? Make a make a make a make a survival check. Don't or, like or that. Nature, or nature, whatever you prefer. Uh, it's a sixteen on survival, which is better than my nature. So. Um. Yeah, you get the sense that something definitely some creature, big creature, created this, but you also get the sense that it didn't dig itself in; it dug itself out. Um, what? Ominous. <laughs> That's so much worse. That's so much worse. <laughs> Digging yourself in. Cozy, homely, cottage core. <laughs> Digging yourself out. Eldritch horror. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, I, I was really hoping we were going to face the cozy, homely cottage core Abeleth and not. <laughs> <laughs> like, it kind of comes out I'm in a little tea? dress with flowers on. Like, what? <laughs> 
Oh, I put food in the stove. cookies, adventurers! <laughs> Shall I put the argon for You're you? Staying for stew? Um... My wife so, will be home shortly. some big bastard dug itself out. Do I get any idea of how long ago, how old this tunnel is? Ooh. Um... Uh, you're 16, right? Yeah. Ex exact time, you're not sure, but um, judging by how more than two decades ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lo way more. Um. Well, wait. Probably. Uh, basically, what I'm trying to what I'm trying to what I'm trying to suss out here is. Is it the Aboleth, or was it something when, you know, hundreds of years ago, when no, the no, this Seed is, of Flame, like... You, you get the sense that, um... Hmm... Trying to pick my words very carefully here. You get the sense that this passage has been made a while ago, pretty long ago, mm -hmm. like years ago. Yeah. But you also get the sense that it is very frequently used. Nice. So, although it was made years ago, there have been recent coming and going. Yes. I, That's terrible news. I, I'll sign to Kess. If we knew the thing was in there, we could just cause a cave in. Just trap it in. But we need to go in there. Right, mm -hmm. so this tunnel sees some regular use, so I suggest that from this point on we are on on our best, most vigilant guard in case of spontaneous death. Um. Yes, sir. Give me a quick sec. Mm -hmm. I have to open your sheets real quick because I want to check something. If it's our passive perceptions. Mine's... No, <clears throat> it is not. If it's our passive, it's our languages. Because no, it's going to be like our, our saving throws or some shit, and someone's going to get mind control. Well, which one of you has the lowest wisdom? <laughs> not, <laughs> not me. Not You're me. all pretty wise. Or... It's Brooks, I think. <laughs> Ever plus one. My yeah. wisdom's fourteen plus two. Mine wisdom is My twenty. 30. It's definitely Brooks. Brooks is less wise what about, than. What about Jax? Well, Jax. Oh, Jax is. Uh, I don't think it would be Jax, two. but. Plus okay. Yeah. Brooks is a 13, I think is uh, the worst. Okay. In that case, I want everybody to just deafen real quick besides Brooks. Besides uh, Brooks. Uh, <laughs> is this the first time I get oh, a one on one no. with Dutch in campaign? Wow. Maybe. Yeah. Could be a short one. This is our first one on one. Oh, cute. I'll deafen oh, now. Deafen. Um, you hear this voice in the back of your head. Ooh. Are you sure you want to do this? Leave now. Make a wisdom saving throw. Uh, wisdom saving throw. Uh, 13. You suddenly are convinced this is a very bad idea and you want, you don't, you don't want to go in there. You do not want to go in there. Okay. That's all I'll give you. Well, we don't Yo. have Soko now, so who's going to be the last to undeafen? It's going to be Duke. Who's it going to be? It's, it's going to be Duke. Duke. <laughs> it's gonna be Duke yeah. Yep. We can't even see if he's looking here or not. Yeah, true. I made it. I made it. Hello. Sorry. You're good. You're good. Look, so... A whole conversation earlier. Going to be less reckless. Mm. First step in that process. This is a bad fucking idea. I don't like this at all. This is a bad idea. Um, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna like, wait. Can I? I'm gonna pull the uh, the tears out of my shirt nice. mm -hmm. and just kind of hold them in the palm of my hand and look at them. And just what are they? What are they? You know? What are they telling me? I'm just. I'm. They're just begging me to go in there. Yeah. 
they they want to be reunited with their with the last piece and everything it's telling you every fiber in your body is convinced that it's in that it's somewhere in that cavern i mean brooks we know it's a bad idea no no like it. we do bad ideas bad ideas is our niche this is not good this He's is bad fuck you... this is not okay is everything a have you had you a drink getting... this morning or no? Yeah, you're getting nervous? <laughs> no, I, mean, I don't need a drink. We need to. It not... sounds like you need a drink. Keep but... going. Oh. No, no. Can I. Yeah, can I. After this sort of insight check, Brooks? Because I've never seen Brooks like scared, right? He's sure. always been yeah, pretty like cool hardy. Uh, that's a 25. You can see a slight haze over Brooks's eyes. He, you get the sense that he is that he is not himself right now. I will. How long does the dome last? If it's a minute, then I'm not fucking doing it. It's one minute. Fuck. Fuck. Hmm. I will. Can I do it cheaper? <laughs> no, I can fucking you? can't. No. Anything, anything on discount, bro? Nothing on discount. <laughs> mates rates? Yeah, he is no, pledged no to mates. the goddess of trade. True. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, true, yeah. Can... Can, I, can, I, can I cast as a first level instead? Can he haggle? I, can I, I cast will... as a first level now and then a first level I'll later? I'll you two first yeah. level spell slots for one third level. Yeah. <laughs> I will <laughs> cast Calm Emotion. Like a sorcerer can do that, right? Uh, yeah, you have to I'm have the spells sure. to it. You can do some weird yeah. minimum. I'll cast Calm Emotions. Spell levels okay, to sorcery hold points. Uh, to sorcery points to spell levels. Calm Emotions for, um, for It's each humanoid in a 20 foot radius sphere sends in the point you choose within range. You must make a Christmas saving throw. A creature can choose to fail the saving throw if it wishes. I'll kind of look at Brooks. Everything over. Okay, I think you're. Okay, okay. Hey, okay, let, um, let me help you. Brooks? And I can I'm end the charm. Willing. You're not willing. You you wanna you wanna try and save out of this. Yeah, so charisma? I need you to make that save make, throw. Yeah. That's a five. There you fail. So you are okay. now the um, charm, fine. The charm that goes briefly had you in its grasp fades away. And Elazarin, you look at Brooks's eyes and you can see that like that hazy effect dissipates. Oh, I was hoping he'd just be chill and charmed. Uh, <laughs> as a point of no. It does come back only after only a last for a minute. Yeah, I know, but this is a temporary measure <laughs> Okay. <laughs> until I can do it permanently. Well, I'm just, I, I, like, I, just, I just want to say, like, how, how many people can that affect? Common it affects everyone in the area. So, uh, you know, I'm going to take, I'm going to take some of that. Don't, don't mind me. I'll take yeah, some common emotions. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Take a deep breath and, yeah. and yeah, confidently yeah, start striding way. forward. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you all just, it, stay within twenty feet of me, and you guys will be fine for the next minute. All right. Okay. Dutch. Uh, Hello. I will. I will say to. Oh, Am sorry. I aware of any difference after being calm emotioned? Do I feel different in any way? Um. You know yeah. What happened? A slight headache. So you kind yeah. of have this. You still, even now that now that you're like temporarily fine, you feel something has a hold of you somehow. You feel that. Um, something or someone is is living inside your head right now, uh, and has a grasp on you. Rent free. I will, <laughs> uh, as Brooks is still near me, I will say, um, this is only will last about a minute or so. But you had something definitely controlling you. You had a haze uh, in your eyes. I don't like this feeling at all. Uh, well, old. we've got a minute. <laughs> we've got a minute. Yeah. So I'm if gonna I just start, go. I start handing all of my weaponry over to Elazarin. While he's doing that, and when yeah. right as he's done, when the last weapon hands over, I just walk yeah. over just in case. I just like slap Brooks, not to cause like harm, but just enough to like kind of like like the snap out of it, kind yeah, of yeah, yeah, smack and see if anything happens. I mean, he doesn't have the haze. He's, it, I know, right but now, he said right he said there's still. technically not charmed, so. so well, has has <laughs> <We're> just hitting him. <laughs> has Brooks Brooks didn't oh. tell us. He he just kind of told us he didn't like it, so I guess we don't really know for sure. But Elazar I mean, knows. I, knows. I've yeah, I've, I know, and I'm so sad. Like 
like I've seen the fucking g- a glaze been, of a charm effect that I've, I've been slapped with a lot of. I've been slapped by a lot of people before, but normally after I've slept with them, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I signed a kiss. I've seen people do it before to snap people out of things. Sometimes it works. I thought I'd give it a shot. Well, she says she hates you. you could die. <laughs> no, no, I don't know. In, <laughs> in, in the weird chain reaction of you giving me weapons, I kind of start passing them to Jax. <laughs> like, you know, Jax like, is just putting them in the bag holding. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. I, I have, like, I start pulling, holding, like, I give you my entire bag because that's got crowbars and hammers in it. Like, I just oh, hand Jesus. my bag over to you. Well, Everything that could be used uh, as a weapon, you hand over. Yeah, and we're doing this, so I guess, as we as we're walking. As we're into going the tower, I want to make the yeah, most of this minute. Yeah, uh, we're going to go say that you can, but like by the time you're done it. and all your possessions are gone, that yeah. calm emotion starts fade. Yeah. Um, okay, you gone, venture Purple. into this this cavern and you keep you keep descending. Uh, you go, you're going down. Um, what happens to down me after the? Does it ever get deep enough that the we'll pressure that, we'll starts to? That. Bother our ears at all? Like you know, when you dive deep and you feel uh, like we got bubbles. The... We got head pressurized head bubbles. Sure. I guess yeah, the bubbles would be pressurized. <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, uh, the rest our of head, us, our head is fine. Lungs have collapsed. Yeah. <laughs> Fully... <laughs> no, it's fantasy, fingers have began to swell. It's fine, guys. Okay. It's a magic okay. volcano with mm-hmm. with magical charms. Oh god. Magical Don't water. I know it, baby? Um, the collapse of lungs. The crystals that kind of. Uh, uh, pierce out of the, the the cavern walls, glow in a variety of different tints of purple and blue. Uh, you eventually make it to kind of what seems like a tear in the floor, Ooh. a very wide tear, like like a chasm oh, almost. I oh, I hate it. Uh, you I'll seem s- to have hit the bottom of the volcano, but there's something under it. As that like minute wears and off, and that is probably is- where the Calm motions fades and Brooks that that like feeling of just not wanting to be here right now takes takes like f- takes back over essentially. How strong is this feeling? Like it's the biggest feeling right now. Yeah. I turn around, and start walking away, That's like at pace. Just grab him. I will attempt to break out of that. Okay. Uh, in that case, Diagon is trying to grapple him. So, uh, athletics yeah. versus Brooks. Athletics or acrobatics? Oh, no How fair. desperate am I to get away from this? I um, mean, you can. No, no. I think the grappler has to do athletics, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm like, God damn it! And he'll get to choose. He could be the better uh, one. How desperate am I to get away from oh, this? Oh, yikes! I mean, you don't want to be there. Period. And you're not gonna like, have to try that hard. This is uncomfortable. Don't want right to be now. there, or like. I need to get out of here. Probably the ladder. Okay. Uh, we'll I'm see how send, this first one goes. I'm going to send Onu down as well to grab him. Okay. Well, that's a, an 18. A five. So you're, you're just, I miss. The water throws me. Okay. So you like kind of just like see that Diagon is going for, for a grab and just kind of yeah, uh, pushes off off. Onu then yep. comes down and is trying to like. <laughs> Octopus yeah. tentacles all around you. Uh, is Ono also just going to try and grapple? Yeah, I mean, why not? Oh, fuck it. It's not good. It's, uh, let me see. I rolled a six. And Mine's strength. a sixteen. So yeah, no chance. Even with even with proficiency or anything, yeah. Yeah, so that also doesn't work. And Brooks is just like he's going. He's leaving. Um. <laughs> Signed to Kess, I mean, if we spend too much of our energy forcing him to come with us, it's just gonna be a liability when the thing gets here. Like, do we just let him go? I'm gonna run after him. I will. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. As I as I start as I start going after him. Okay, I'm gonna grab a Lazarin, mm-hmm. and I'm gonna pull a Lazarin with me. No, Jax, because Jax is stronger. I'm gonna grab Jax. I'm gonna pass Jax the rope of a like just a length of rope, the end of a, a, a hemp rope, and I'm gonna have the other end. And we're just gonna I'm just gonna go try and try and snag him, I guess. Okay. <clears throat> but right, yeah, you motherfuckers. 
Freaking nice, like a pool, you know, like a little pool, like chewed like a rat. Yeah. Siren, like a child leash. Like, like <laughs> sees that, uh, and is also going to react. Um, she's gonna cast Thorn Whip on you, Brooks. She's gonna oh. try to just yank you, like a, like a thorn okay. whip yank you back. Which is a, I think it's just a, a roll to hit, right? I yes. believe so. Oh, ooh, that's an eighteen to hit. That hits. Um, you do take some damage, but, you know. Maybe the damage might snap him out of it, smiley face. You take uh, three <laughs> points of piercing damage, uh, but you okay. do get to re-roll your your wisdom saving throw. Oh. Nope. It's a four. <laughs> All right, uh, Davian and Jax are doing. They're trying to like tie him up, or yeah, I guess. I'll, I'm, if if it comes to an athletics check or anything, can I just leave that to Jax with advantage? Is that possible? Sure. Yeah. Sure. 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 Um. Yeah. I mean, Brooks. These people are trying to like stop you from uh from the. You got pulled ten foot closer to Siren, so back to where you know, back to like the entryway into that like chasm. Uh, so you got pulled 10 foot back because of the uh, thorn whip. And that, that's the opportunity that, that Davian and Jax take to try and fucking tie a rope around you. Um, we'll, we'll make this another grapple. We'll make this another grapple. Okay. So Jax will have advantage. advantage? Yeah. I'll roll for wrong? Jax. Okay. Just, what does he have for his athletics? Uh, plus two. Plus two. All right. okay. Wait, mine is better than that. Can I roll? You roll Too late. Advantage. You said it. Is it yeah. too late? Okay. Yeah, I yeah. rolled already. Uh, 13? I rolled a 15 for Jax. Hey. Okay. okay. So you are now like rope around you. Jax has it pulled like taut. You, you're not going anywhere. Is it now uh, my turn? Yeah. Okay. I mean, can I say, can I swim up? At this point, when I see he's like been grappled. I just want to mm -hmm. try and slap him with an numb strike. Uh, we'll see. What, we'll see. Like, with a numb what, what do you want to do first, Brooks? And then we'll, we'll get to that. Uh, I'm now grappled, yeah? Yes, you are. Yeah. Uh, and tied up. Or at least in the process. Yeah, there's a rope, like, basically what I imagine is you've you've put the rope, like, around his waist, and so it's, you, you can pull him towards yeah. you, but it hasn't, like, been properly tied yet. You haven't bound, like, his uh, hand, his arms or anything? Yeah, exactly. I'm going to bonus action rage and attempt to break the grapple. Okay. So I get advantage on my check, on my... Uh, Can I be the roller now for this grapple? Sure. sure with sure. A, with advantage from Jax? Yeah, okay. it's a, a joint effort. Yeah, absolutely. So while you're rolling and they're struggling, this isn't an action. It's just again talking. While Kess and I are watching, go. I don't understand. What is the point of bringing a weaponless and bound, dragging him with us? He's not going to help. What are they doing? Someone just tell him to let him fucking go. I got a fifteen. I got an eleven. So I'm back out. I'm bolting it another 40 feet. I am faster than all of these motherfuckers. Well, Can I try and challenge him? Hold. Can you what? Oh. Can you charm an already charm? Counter oh. charm used to be a thing. Counter charm. It used to, it charm used to the be a charmed. Thing. Uh, no, you can't because he's already in their charm okay. effect. What are you? What are you trying to do, last one? I was gonna before he swam away. Mm -hmm. Gonna try and swim up and slap him in the face. Okay. Time to wake the fuck up. <laughs> like basically, get together, man. Well, as what as if he's bolting, then I'm just gonna again swim over quickly to a Lazarin and Davian, just like tap them on the shoulder, and just make this gesture, like cut it out, and and point to Kess, and see if she'll reiterate what I said earlier. She doesn't think it's worth it. What I mean, was the point of bringing him? He's, if he's bound biggest, and weaponless. Literally one of our strongest allies. I signed to Cass again. He's only our strongest ally if he'll fight for us. If he's shitting his pants and trying to run away, he's useless. I'll just repeat that verbatim. Okay. He's a liability. No, he's more than. He's worse than useless. He's a liability because we're gonna have to protect him. I'll secret flame on him. Okay. He's running away. Yeah. I'll just be like, oh, last hurrah, and just kind of point at him. Is that a deck save? <laughs> it's a deck save. Alright, Brooks. I don't win these. I do, actually. I win these. It's a cantrip, so you'll avoid all damage if you save. It's a 23. <laughs> yeah, it's... <laughs> okay. Just... 
Well, I tried. I <clears throat> I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna shoot a blinding arrow. Okay. I'm really getting fucked up. Leave him to vault. Just rage. Fine. Give, give me a quick. Give me a quick. Yeah, I used one of my two rages. You're fine. Mm. Just so dumb. Be bare white. Just let him fucking dude. go. Maybe he'll step out of it when we fight the Abeleth, and he'll come help us, and he'll be like the the yeah, hero but... who arrives late and is like the hot tag but... in a, in, a, in a tag team wrestling match. And when, come in all and like, when we're yeah. all dead, and he comes and sees all his I'm dead friends. I'm gonna say that even though it's not a written rule that dexterity saves are at this advantage in the water, to me, it makes sense makes that sense. dex yeah. saves okay. in particular are with his advantage because you're trying to actively dodge something and the water is That's a natural that one. Oh! Okay. Like, I think Which means he's sick of flamed it is. Yeah, I'm yeah, going I'm to. Really, Come I'm, on. I'm, I'm, I always roll like a one. by Jesus. I always roll like a one on these. So now it's time to roll an eight. It's a five. <laughs> Well, no, you okay. want to roll low because he's gonna have to make yeah. the save. Yeah. So, no, I've it. said, I'm yeah. no, I'm saying. If oh, I, got, I, I always you, I roll you, I when I need it. Time yeah. to roll on eight because it's it. You take five points. Okay. Of uh, that means you get to re-roll the save again, Brooks. The wisdom save. And for radiant damage, natural one. Still trying. Hey. To... How, is he, how is he so bad at this? Okay. I don't know. Blinding I'm rolling like shit. Yeah, I after after I try that and it like doesn't work, I kind of just look at Dyke and go, Yeah, I mean, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Blinding arrow, blinding arrow. Okay, yeah, sure. Um, now this is just on hit. He's blinded, so. Okay. Uh, is, it roll, is it a roll to hit? Yeah, it's. I'm firing out of my bow. So. Okay. Uh, disadvantage because you're underwater. Okay. First is a twenty-five. Uh oh. Next is a twelve. <laughs> my but, AC is above twelve. Oh, I'm sure it is. I mean, I, I was gonna say, but like. You know, maybe it hits the wall and explodes. I don't fucking know. It wouldn't yeah, but... damage him, but it might blind him. Uh, I mean, no, it's it's like a on you know, no. It's yeah, like, it you is, missed, yeah. you missed. Yeah. Therefore, it's not going to do anything. Okay, I mean, with that, Bruce uh, is uh, well, open. well, um, freaking octopus boy is faster than him. Okay. So you can harass me with an octopus. I might harass you with an octopus. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm okay. gonna. While Davian's like firing his thing, I just sign the cast. I'm like, I can't, it's like, just, no one listens. Just stupid. Uh, yeah. I, 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 the best I can do is attack with Onu, which might hurt, but also will grapple him. So, uh, let me see. He's taking damage. He's what, sort of... What's Onu's swim speed? 60 feet. Oh, you don't even have 40 feet swim speed, dude. That's like 20 feet. Yeah, but no, but I've, I've been dictated that you can walk. Oh, you're walking. Under, okay. You're underwater, but you're walking. Even, even if we weren't walking, I was trying to do the math on it because swimming is half is yeah, difficult true. terrain. Onu is literally a fish boy, so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let me see. If, if we're walking, I think I outpace him. Oh my if god. I... At 14 to hit. No. I mean, yeah, Brooks, Absolutely uh, Brooks is going. I'll just, yeah, I'll, I'll say, Davion, I think, um, Dagon's right here. I think we, hopefully he snaps out when he comes Can back. I stick Onu to him? Just grapple, surely. Not grapple, but just... Grapple's like he's trying to forcibly hold him yeah, still. Not, if not you're just grapple, sticking to him, it's like, I'm just sucking him. onto you, but not controlling yeah. or inhibiting his... Yeah, I mean, you can, yeah, if it's just like, Onu is just gonna stick with Brooks kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah, sure. buddy. Unless Brooks like, I'm... Brooks's mindset is he wants to get away. So like, if Onu comes with him, that's not that doesn't interfere with that. So yeah, I don't think yeah 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 yeah. We're thinking. As long as <gasps> so it doing that, get in the way of my escape. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. While they're doing that, I signed a Kess. By the way, if we can get the bag of holding at some point, it's all gone. All his shits in it. <laughs> Way to kick a man while he's down. <laughs> Fucked up. <laughs> Okie dokie. So what does the rest of you do now that Brooks is going and Ono is with them? No. I'm just waiting for them all to decide to leave Brooks alone and then we'll... I mean, I guess we'll just, I'm just dead. I'm just on to go. Yeah. I think it's time to go, Devin. I believe you're... Are you still wanting to take the lead here? I'll join someone else. 
I'm not going kind of, to kind of what looking a at Dyke in a little bit. Bitch. <laughs> my okay, uh, so my last my last ditch effort was going to be just pour some fucking whiskey down his throat, but uh, <laughs> we couldn't get him to hold still for long enough. No, if I the spell wears we... off, then he'll come back. Who knows the spell? So, only can guide him back. Sounds good. But this is a long tunnel, and if he makes it all the way mm. back out, that's a long time we've got to wait. And hopefully, we won't all be dead by then. Way to look on the bright side. As you know. Pretty fucking dark to look on the bright side. Um, Anyways. Okay. Can what everybody can just like deafen real quick? Like, real quick. Besides Ethan, of course. I have to pee, so I'm gonna go pee as well. I don't know why he told us. We never would have known. Um, Brooks, as you're leaving... They're going to attack me. Come back. Protect me. <laughs> but, but... Don't act out. Make them believe on their side still. You know, this is some really fucking uh, conflicting information. Okay, fine. Whatever. Fuck this. No. Oh. Trying to not have you be abandoned out of the fucking boss fight, alright, man? Fuck. <laughs> I figured one of those oh, things would work. Things to fucking it, didn't. Things, so I had you, to you figured I would it. make my wisdom saves with a plus one? Oh, man. Ah. Absolutely. When we were deafened, it was so creepy because there's like directionality in this underwater like layer. Yeah. Ambience, so it sounds like things are like swimming around behind me. Yeah. And so I'm just like, oh, this is creepy <laughs> without that... other things going on. I don't also, like <laughs> Also, nothing quite like hitting the undeafened and hearing Dutch being like, I want you out of it. I'm like, oh no. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't want, I don't He's want to coming back. Out of the fucking boss fire. So I was like, yeah, this man's really coming back, on. but is he coming back as himself? <laughs> coming back to kill you all, motherfucker. Yeah. Just I have actually magically summoned three different shadow blades and a shadow axe. Oh, good lord. He just had At least, just even if he does come back, he's unarmed. All he can do is punch us. True. Oh, yeah, Which still hurts a lot, but, yeah. you know. I'm gonna say, that still fucking hurts like a truck, man. <laughs> yeah. Yo, oh, he's yeah. Man. Hello. Hello. All he has is well, fists. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, but you're gonna get hit by, like, a transit van instead of a truck? Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna get hit by a fucking I transit van. He's gone for a pee, Laura. Pee. Oh. He said he was going to pee. Oh, I didn't, I didn't know that. My bad. Ay, ay, ay. Whoopsies. Ay, 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 ay. But yeah, literally, I have just this, like, it's called Underwater Lair Evil Ambiance, what I'm listening to, and it's real fucking creepy when there's no other sound. I don't like it. Yeah, it works. Oh, it has some Occam's Laser on here. <laughs> mm -hmm. The playlist we're listening to has some cool artists on it that are... Yeah. Uh, Say hello, sorry. Hello, no worries. Stream safe. Okay. So. Gang Gang. That's the party name right there. Done. Gang gang. Gang gang. I guess I will um the rag type gang gang. Pray that <laughs> the uh tears will just guide me to whatever direction we have to go. That's yeah, it's seemingly pointing towards that chasm. It wants you to uh swim through. Well That's cool. Away we go. Alright, and as you enter And I guess yeah, I guess I'll lead the way and start to swim ahead. As you enter, you are still in the water. Uh, you're in this big flooded ca flooded cavern. Uh, down below, you can see this like bright, shining purple swirl of stars, almost as if you're looking at, at like a very clear sky uh, in the middle of the night. Um, Fuck yeah! There are some kind of like floating pieces of wall and floor of like some kind of structure that seems very alien to you that the architecture Underwater does not make that. sense uh almost as if it's not from this plane uh oh God. blue and purple crystals that all kind of like float around uh emitting this light um this seems like some kind of weird like you're in a place that shouldn't be here, but 
it's here. And as you enter, the thing burrowing out. It really and stuck. and as you enter, you just hear this voice in the back of your heads, all of you. You are brave to step into my realm. You cannot oppose the might of Estesia and Ilun. And suddenly you see from like the far depths, these eyes open, but instead of like aligned horizontally, they're stacked vertically. Three Ew. bright blue eyes. Uh, the blue crystals start to light up the chasm to reveal this large aberration with a round mouth and sharp teeth. A short, stubby body that quickly transforms what into four it? large tentacles and one large tail with sharp fins. You've seemingly found uh, Estesha's pet. Okay. I don't like it. <laughs> the... So there's like weird architecture and crystals floating around and shit, right? Like, are they floating or are they secured to the floor and like built up or what? Um, they are floating, as in like they're not mm -hmm. stuck, not attached to anything, but they are like stationary. If that makes sense. Okay, I immediately just want to try and swim behind something, <laughs> just whatever it might uh, be, whether it's I mean, a wall or a... they're like they're, they're not very big. They're just there for the sake of lighting, if more than anything. It's like they're not very large. That's all. Uh oh. They only need to be as big as me, and I'm not very big. Yeah, but they're not they're not people sized. How far away is it from us? Um we'll say that you guys came in from like here. Just give me a second to like fucking move everything. Or I reveal this on stream. I've cast May Drama, by the way. Okay. So no. Um, let me just quickly bop. There we go. Uh, right now, as it stands, you are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 times 5, 80, 80. feet away. Yeah. 8, 8, 0? 8, 0. Yes. Um... And our movement is halved, like normally, it's because it's a swimming difficult terrain. Yeah. So All your movement will be half of what it normally okay. would be. Okay. So if my normal speed, so my base speed would be twenty, and then with that means with dash and feline agility, it could be eighty. Okay. Just yes. Me. I needed to, but then the dash is my action, which is yucky. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> I get my spear out and just hold it. Prepare. There's nothing I can hide behind. Doesn't Look seem at like the it. map. It's empty AF. <sighs> Ain't nothing. It's, pr it's pretty cringe. Is that? <laughs> Aye. All right. Okay. Um. Fuck. I mean, it has not attacked you. Are we? Yet. Are we it, it, uh, okay. But it, it's communicating in our brain, right? Telepathically. Yeah. Telepathically, I just... it can Do I? Mm, yeah. If I think hard back, <clears throat> just thinking really loud. Only one way to find out. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just gonna think in my brain. I'm just gonna be like, <laughs> well, where else am I gonna think? <laughs> Your toes. Just hand over the tear, and you don't have to die. <laughs> You hear this, like, guttural sound in the back of your head, all of you. Oh, no. Which, with, like, with a little imagination, is probably what it sounds like if some eldritch horror starts laughing. Oh, good. Okay. We're... Fighting hasn't ensued yet. Do I get the sense that the tear is in this room? Yes. Oh my god, it's gonna be inside the other book, isn't it? I'm gonna, okay. Can I cast Hunter's Mark? Sure. Is shit gonna. Okay, I'm gonna cast Hunter's Mark on him real quick. On the, um, on and the then I'm gonna. Creature? On the Aboleth, yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna hold out. I'm just gonna hold out the other two tiers in the hope that Spice and Magical Magnetic Force, they're gonna reunite in this room. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing happens. Uh, but as you. <laughs> Hunter's nice Mark, try. this uh, being, it just shouts out, no longer telepathically, it just shouts out these like, Archgund, 
which I don't think anybody here speaks deep speech, right? Let's be fucking real. No, speak deep. No, 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 no. I huh? speak deep. You do? I speak deep. <laughs> yeah, deep speech. I speak deep. Speak deep speech. <laughs> He's been well, waiting for his balls to drop for 24 sessions. Speak deep! What the <laughs> fuck is the last one to speak deep speech, dude? Like, what is the logic? <laughs> because it's such a rare language, right? And the last one wants to, like, edge. He wanted the edge up on, like, oh other and shit. And he fucking learned it. I'm assuming, like, Valid, like, fucking tore it to him or some shit. Like, it's just it's a weird fucking language. I speak My under boy, no fucking weird deep. languages, dude. My that's why just all weird languages. fucking underdark. Yeah. I'm here to talk to you about well, your car you insurance. Know what it said then. <laughs> yeah. And um, to you, hold on quickly. Grab the fucking. That's just like shit. Made. Now I have to decide what it said. No, no, no. no. <laughs> I mean, yes, no, <laughs> no. It um, seemingly he he spoke some kind of almost like not necessarily a prayer, but um, kind of speaking to. Um, to the powers within him, um, he said, the powers to overthrow the gods have blessed me before. Let them bless me again this day. What? Oh, I would like creepy. you all to roll initiative. Okay. Okay. Uh, bef okay, <laughs> I'm gonna put it up to, to you guys because we're about okay. 25 minutes before we usually take a break. Do we want to take a break now because combat is gonna be a while? Yeah. Could, well, yeah, we, yeah, should, yeah. we could take a break now, but roll our initiative and just put yeah, it in the chat so you can do the setting up initiative. We get yeah. into fucking combat. I'm assuming Natural you, twenty. You would like me to roll initiative uh, at this point? Yes, but at this point as well, like towards the end of that conversation, Brooks, you would have made your way to like to like the castle. Yes. Thank you're, God for you're, that. You're there. you're there. You're there. And Onu was well. I'm fucking back, baby. Laura, um, did you roll with advantage? I did roll with advantage, yeah. Your initiatives, and then we'll get to break, and then we'll, we'll get fucking okay. cracking. We just put, put, put it all in the Discord right, chat. I, I've got my I can't initiative, then I'll be right back. Um, oh, okay. Hold on, just with, do it the usual way. I'm quickly roll for this guy. My okay. rolls today, eating ass. <clears throat> hold on. I found some really cool underwater okay. battles. Uh, 20 plus? 23 with a nat 20. Okay. Anyone else 20 plus? All right, uh, 15 to 20. <laughs> Yay. I got 18. 18. Uh, Duke got 17. Uh, what's your be. dex, Laura? Ah, oh, it's probably high. My dex is plus, okay. it's a de uh, 18. Davian got a 17, you said? Yeah. Okay. Uh, 10 to 15. I got an 11. 11. Uh, oh Brooks shit, and... I need to roll for Jax as well. Yeah, yeah. Brooks and Jax. Uh, Jax got... Uh, it's it's minus eight. one or something. Eight? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What did you get, Brooks? His minus two. Oh, uh, really? I got a uh, nine. I rolled, he rolled a ten, I rolled a six, and I still got higher than this man. Alright, uh, <laughs> we'll get into our break now then, just for the sake of not having to interrupt combat, because, you know, yeah. you know how it be. So we're going on a break now, I'll make sure that the initiative is in order and all that stuff during the break. And we'll be right back, gamers, for, uh, yeah, we had a good boss fight in a while, right? Boss fight! Let's go! Boss fight! <laughs> oh, nice. My, my son oh. was up, I promise <laughs> That was good. That was a great oh, moment to fucking undeafen. <laughs> Alrighty. God. Piper deserves better. Oh, lefty. I was getting rid of the charm effect. <clears throat> right, right, right. Yeah, of course. Um, <laughs> Okie dokie. Oh, does that mean Ono's here? Ono was here, yeah. 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 I, made oh, him no. still. I made him a little tentacle. Ono was holding my hand and guiding me back. Okay. So with that said and done, you are now in initi initiative. Uh, Kess, you get to go first. Yes. Uh, can I bonus action cast Hex? Sure. What's the range on Hex? Is it like 100 and... 90 feet. feet. 90 feet? Okay, yeah, you can. You can. Okay, cool. And then Eldritch Blast. <laughs> All right, yeah, roll attack. Woo. I feel like that, like this Eldritch Blast is going to be such a like heavy hitter for us during this fight because it's not impeded by water. It's a damage type that I don't think it would be resisted to for any reason. And it's cantrip. 
And yeah, so it's just like, boom. Country boys, uh, Wait, 22 to hit. Bell, do you have like the Eldritch invocations or whatever it is? Uh, not can, like... the one that makes, uh, not the one that you're thinking of. Okay, so you can't blast two or whatever. No. All right, so what did you roll to, uh, to attack? To, to hit, I mean? 22. 22, that does hit. Excellent. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, my dice. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, hell yeah. Eight, uh, force damage. Eight force damage. Um. <clears throat> and, uh, three thunder, I think. Is that an I think or is that an I'm sure? <laughs> I'm just checking. Okay. Uh, two thunder. Two thunder? That's it. Okie dokie. So you open up and just this this beam of, of purple energy just leaves your uh, your hand and just poof, impacts the, the 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 just the face if you can call it that uh, of uh, of the Aboleth and it just screeches in this like gargle this gurgling sound. Um, is that your turn? Yep. All right. Uh, then now. Before anything <laughs> else. Know. Oh no, lair actions! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no! My favorite. Mm. The lair rolled high. And the lairs, I mean, lairs are always 20. in 20. Um, I need that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only potentially going to run a largely underwater campaign next few months. I knew that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Okay. It is going to summon uh, pools of water, kind of like oh, wait. underwater. Yeah. yeah, but it's gonna yeah, but just hear me out, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. <laughs> um, <clears throat> within the water you're in, there's these like these like circular pools, kind of like uh, start start swirling and bubbling, and you all feel this like just gripping. This gripping sensation, oh, trying no. to pull you down. I need all of you to make a strength saving throw, including. Oh uh, no! I haven't had time to bamf my arms out yet. I mean, I could. So, uh, this little oh. for flavor. Mm -hmm. So there's there's a there's a aerated water is non buoyant water, and it's me. It means that it's water that you will sink in, and it's really hard to swim in. Mm -hmm. So, uh, the basically, if there were pockets of gas that then erupted into the water, the water that we were in would become aerated and non-buoyant and we would end up sinking in it, you know? Yeah, sure. <laughs> or magic make water heavy. But, um, yeah, <laughs> just uh, make me a strength saving throw, everybody. Where the fuck's my character sheet? 11. 11? 12. 12. This is not fucking minus 1. to strength. Oh, 16. Okay. Uh, does Onu have to save as well? Everything, yeah. Okay. I I got a dirty twenty on my save. Okay. Uh, oh, you got a. Those who rolled under fourteen. Uh, -uh. uh let me know who that is, please. Jax. Okay. Onu. Uh, hold on. Jax Onu Lazarin Kess. Okay, so those are all knocked. Prone. Yay! That's so, fine. Uh, we got Onu, we got Siren, we got Jax. Who else? Elazarin Cass. Elazarin yeah. Cass. Okay. That's it. Yeah, those four. So you are all you are all knock prone. Yay! Uh, and that is it. Uh, the rest of you who ma who made the save, so fourteen or more, uh, you're fine. You you resist the pull okay. and and you're you're vibing. Um, okay. Daigon, it is your turn. Uh, I'm going to, for my action, will be dash and combine that with my feline agility to give me 80 feet. And I want to, like, because I got my spear out, basically kind of, like, put the end of my spear in the ground and kind of, like, push off to give me a boost to add mm -hmm. the feline agility. And I want to dash to it and behind it. And I want to get in back of it if How I can. much, like, total movement speed do you have? 80, 80. Mm -hmm. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75. 80 will get you to, to a side. 
Okay, I'll take that. And then when I get there, bonus action, bamf out my spectral arms. It has to make a dexterity save. Okay. Quickly have a look, make sure that I have a little stash in front of me. Dex save, um, it fails. Well, my, my DC is not that high, so are you sure? Uh, yeah, natural three. It's, it's oh, it oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It fails. Okay. <laughs> it takes seven points of force damage from the energy of my arms coming out. Okay, okay. Seven points of energy as you summon your spectral, spectral panther arms, arms and just like, like surrounding you. Very fucking cool. Anything else? And my physical, my physical hands are still holding my spear and I just take a kind of ready stance, ready to stab next turn. Okay. Is that your turn? Yeah. Okay, well, it I is use now bonus action the Abeleth, or Ilun, as he called himself uh, briefly. Um, oh. It's turn, and it is going to... Ba -ba -ba -ba. What's the range and all of that? Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. Uh, I mean, you just kind of presented yourself, didn't you? So it's going to um, just lash, just like swipe at you with one of his tentacles, uh, Daigon. With a 24 to hit. Jesus. Yeah, that hits. You take. Come at me, bruh. Uh, 10 points of bludgeoning damage. Okay, don't come at me that hard. That's, that's um, unnecessary. And I need you to make a constitution saving throw. Oh, of course, it's going to have poison tentacle bullshit. 13. 13, you fail the save. Ah. And that is all I need to know for now. Oh, um, I'm going to become an octopus. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, and that is its turn. Davian. Ah. Uh, uh, so I guess getting up from prone takes half movement, right? So yes. Ona will gather himself and, and swim back to his feet in quotes. Mm -hmm. Um, <laughs> on land, he has a speed of five feet. That's so funny. Uh, <laughs> he's gonna, and then, yeah, he's gonna just, I guess, swim 30 feet straight towards the, the Abeleth with his remaining movement. Mm -hmm. And I have already, <clears throat> excuse me, Hunter's marked the Abeleth. You have. So I guess I'll just shoot him. I mean, go for it. You have this advantage because well, you're in the water, but uh, you know, fuck it. Yep. Best we can do. And it's a nine. There's no way it's going to get better than that. A nine? Yep. Yeah, you fire an arrow and it just like. <laughs> like, it just does not get nearly as far as, as you'd hope it to get, unfortunately. You know, you're getting used to the whole, like, underwater experience of firing your bow. And this is, you know, this is the first time you shot an arrow. Um. Didn't quite work, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Uh. I, I don't. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna stay there. You gonna stay there? And okay. I'll be my turn. Yep. Alrighty. It is now Siren's turn. She's gonna use half of her movement to get up. Uh, let me open her sheet real quick. I mean, she's not going to go anywhere because she only has 15 feet left and it's difficult to range, so she can move up like one square. Like, what's the fucking point? Five um, foot. Huh? Oh, yeah. No, sorry. It's like, imagine just moving five foot. That's like your whole movement speed to be like, woo! <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Um, yeah, she's just... She's going to Hunter's Market. So that is something that she will do. Uh, and then, she's yeah, she's going to also just try her best to fire an arrow at it. With his advantage, so it's a little bit. Uh, 11 plus 5, 16, which misses, unfortunately. So Siren as well, her arrow gets a little closer, but it just like the, the momentum that you have underwater is near non existent, and uh, it just like kind of takes any sort of oomph out of the arrow, unfortunately. And that's her turn. Elazrin. Hey, hi. So I, I see that Brooks is back. Yes. Does he. Still have like a glaze in his eye, or is he? Make an inside check. Cool. Uh, 
14. 14? As far as you can tell, he seems better. Uh, okay, well, regardless, I am going to uh, activate the dome. You going to get up from being prone at all, or are you just going to... I'm going to activate the dome first, and then get okay. up. But yeah, well, I will get up. Prone um, dome. Prone dome. Yeah, well, I'll activate the dome, and I will move the five foot forward that I've got. Just one, one forward. Mm-hmm. Um, and then I will bonus action cast spiritual weapon. I was prepared. Be, 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 be. Be, 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 be. Where'd it go? Uh, 60 foot forward. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So and that's as far as it can go. <laughs> um, and that'll be its turn. Okay. That'll be my turn. Um, and I get fucking... Wow, great. I get 5, 10 HP. Let's go. Hey, man. I mean, it, uh, it's 5 HP nothing. you didn't have before, right? Yep. Just, you know, it's the minimum I can roll. It's fine. Alrighty. Brooks. Hello. It is your turn. Uh, well, shit. I guess first things first, I'm going to go over to Jax and grab my bag off him. Hold on. Um, I think all of my weapons are in the bag of holding. Can you roll me a, an insight check for Jax real quick, just to see if he, like, he'll he'll have a little look at you and be like, oh, is he okay? Uh, insight, that's a seven for Jax. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it seems good to him. Okay. I get my bag off him. Uh, I'm not going to waste an action trying to dig my weapons out of um the bag of holding. Mm -hmm. But I have my, like, my alcohol and any healing potions in the bag and shit, so that's fine. Okay. Um. Hmm. Is it a free action to just grab my backpack if I'm not, like, going into the bag of holding or anything? I'm just grabbing my backpack off him? Sure. Or is that going to cost my action? Nah, I'll give you I'll give you that for free. Okay. How generous. Um. I have 40 foot of movement. Mm-hmm. But it is difficult to rain. Correct. Who's next to me currently? I'm next to Jax right now, right? Uh, and, uh, I mean, yeah, you moved up to uh, Jax, who is like... I mean, Jax is like prone right beside you, actually. So you can just like... Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, <laughs> The only real damage so far has been... Uh, Eldritch Blast from Kess and Dagon, right? Uh, yeah, the summoning of the arms from Dagon, yeah. Okay, which was more damage? I did seven points of damage. Uh, I don't know what the Eldritch Blast okay. was. Cast it ten. Okay. Uh, I'm going to bonus action oh, rage. He's a baddie! Motherfucker, motherfucker. He's no, I'm lit- Okay, that's fine. Whatever. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna bonus action rage. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use my action to drink healing potion. Okay. Uh... So I need to roll 2d4 plus 2. <clears throat> uh, okay, that'll do. That'll do. That'll do, that's 7. Um, I mean, shit. It's hard to tell who's who on the fucking board. I'm the one who's next to the thing. I can help you. Yeah, no, I gathered that. Okay. There. Now their names are there. Um... Well, shit, I moved to Jack, so uh, it's difficult terrain as well, and I don't have a bonus action anymore. Mm -hmm. So I guess I'll just move 10 feet, 15 feet forward. Okay, so you'll be right here, right beside Davian. Davian. All I can do. Okay. I would, with my dome, mm -hmm. like to end a charm or frighten effect on Brooks. Yay! The other useful part of the dome. Okay. Uh, does that like permanently end it, or is it more like a? Um, it ends the effect, Brooks. If yeah! there was a charm effect on me, whatever well, residual charm you know effect what? was there, is now gone, and your mind is your own monster. Okay. Dome is pog. Dome is, is that instead of instead, instead of, of the tip HP? I can do one. Dude, the that's other. a ridiculous spell. The, okay. yeah, the it's not insane. Dude. Dome is insane. Dome. That's why dome. the Abeleth is now gonna be like but a Lazarus. To be fair, to get the him. dome is really good. Early level, but it falls, level. it falls yeah. flat ridiculously fast. Once you get think it falls, level. doesn't fall that flat. It's still like 
ending it, a no, it becomes war. it becomes balanced. I mean, really, like, I'm, I was trying to plead the case for it not being overpowered. We kind of ruined that, Koiba. Yeah. I'm sorry, man. No, it's it's. I mean, it's. <laughs> I mean, it's ridiculous. No, what it is is it's ridiculous early game. It's balanced late game. <laughs> yeah, I guess. I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's what it turns into. Yeah. But okay, uh, that ends Brooks's turn. Jax, what is Jax doing, Ethan? Uh, well, shit. Fuck, like, this is not good for Jax either, because rain shit fucky underwater. Um, Spells aren't. That's true. Um, he is going to... Oh, before we do that, I'm going to quickly do a thing. Uh, breaking a charm piss Diableth off, so he's going to use a legendary action. Of course he is! Uh, he's just going to lash out, and the only thing in range of hit, it to hit is Daigon, so it's just going to fucking swipe Daigon with his tail out Sorry, of sheer frustration. Um, Alright, buddy. So, I didn't end your charm effect, sir. Like, come on. It's a 16 he didn't to know hit. it was me. That just hits. That's that my just armor hits. Class. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's I'm my armor sorry. class. It, it's... The risk of being a melee class, you know? You gotta get yeah, up there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, the for... Abbott doesn't know it was me. He can just... Yeah. Seven <laughs> points of bloodstream damage. As you just get fucking... Ooh, ooh, this is going... I am very close to bloody. Yeah, I mean, you kind of singled yourself out there by being the only one well, <laughs> right beside it. Well, well what I'm else am I gonna do? I'm... Hang out and just be yeah, a cheerleader? No, I, it, I, it, I, I mean, I mean... <laughs> sometimes, it, sometimes it's worth hanging out to be a cheerleader, you know? Ooh. Let it come to us. <laughs> As we get fucked by it. <laughs> well, I was trying to get behind it. I think regardless, you've probably been beating the fuck up. Okay, so is that its legendary action done? Yes, so now it's uh, now it's uh, Jax. Uh, Sorry. Jax is going to move uh, 15 feet forward, because that's all he can. Uh, yeah, so and he's then get, he's pull out get some sort of contraption that I don't remember Soko's flavor for. <laughs> and to fire... Three small projectiles. Oh, are you doing, uh, are you doing catapults? Magic missile. Oh, magic missile. No, magic missile. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, it's auto hit for the win, yeah. Yep. Uh. uh so that's five. Uh. Excuse me. Uh, nine. Ten, Eleven points of force damage. 11 points of force damage already. And he's he still in the dome? Yeah, he's, yeah, he's 30 feet, yeah. Okay, so uh, he won't use his bonus action feature. So that ends his turn. Right, so yeah, so uh, Jax seven. gets up from being knocked on his ass, walks a few feet forward, and then there's these three colorful projectiles just like appear around him and just <laughs> just fly through the water, cut through the water at, at very high velocity and just impact on uh, on the aboleth uh, and again there's just it, it creates it's just like gargling noise every time something impacts it it sounds fucking gross to be honest with you it's disgusting um that's jack's turn yep uh back to cass yay um Still i forgot to mention ass. yeah i forgot to mention last turn as well that i'm choosing wisdom as the ability score to take Good disadvantage to on. Good to know. Good um, to I'm just gonna Eldritch Blast. <laughs> and you're gonna you're gonna do that while you're not prone, or are you just gonna are you gonna get up as well? I'm. I'll get up and do it. I mean, it, you can cast Eldritch Blast from being prone just fine. So if you don't want to use your movements to get up, you can you can just lay down. It's up to nah, you. Nah, I'm good. I mean, to be fair, if you stay laid down and it tries to range attack you, it's gonna struggle. Yeah, Kaz is gonna stay lie down. Oh, she's <laughs> just gonna okay. lie down. Okay. <laughs> Nap, just go to sleep. It's like, fair enough. Uh, oh, this yeah. is nice. I mean, she doesn't sleep, does she? So, twenty-one to hit. That hits. Uh, four, force damage. Um, where is it? There it is. Six necrotic and two thunder. Six necrotic, two thunder. Jesus. Um, okay. She's just chilling out on the floor. Alrighty. Uh, it is now. You get ten from the dome. Ten. There you go. 
maximum. Time for layer another time. layer action. Uh, ba ba bam. Hold on, quickly reading up on something. Uh, Not good. I need all of you, as the Aboleth kind of mutters some words in deep speech. Oh, wait, fuck yeah. I need all of you. Uh, wait, hold on. Does it say everyone it can see or just on any number of creatures it can see? Oh, Ooh. right. Uh, Joke's on you. I'm not but, a creature. I'm a cardboard cutout. Um, actually, no, it's not going to do that. Is it? Wait, one, two, three, oh, four, oh, five, boy. six. That's 30 feet. 40, 50... No, it's not. It's not. Never mind. Scratch that. Scratch that. Um... Record scratch. It is, however, going to on. make the water in its lair to become uh -huh. conduits oh, no. for, the, for its rage. Uh, oh, okay. The Aboleth can target any number of creatures it can see within the water, within 90 feet of it, which is Ew. all of you. I need yep. all of you to make wisdom saving throws. Wisdom? wisdom? Yes. Ay, ay, ay. Natural 20! I Natural 20! Double 7. Oh. I'm searing as well. Yo, oh my god! Hey. I rolled double 7, so that's an 8 for Brooks and a 9 for Jax. All right. Natural 20 for oh. Owen. Oh my god! For, oh what? my god, all the 20s. Fuck. I got 27 total. I got an 11. Okay. I got 22 total with the natural 20. Jesus. So I it's got just... a 19. Okay, it, so it those who Brooks, rolled Jacks and Davian. those who rolled under fourteen. What about Siren? Uh, she, she rolled natural twenty as well. No, oh, bitch. Uh, so those <laughs> who rolled under fourteen take eight points of psychic damage. From okay. the, oh, thank just, God! Cool. Just, like, just those this, under fourteen. Abeleth is channeling all of his rage and anger into the water, and it just starts. It just starts fucking with your head. The water around you just starts fucking with your head, and you take eight points of psychic damage. <laughs> I just think it's just the water gets in your ears, and it's just like... <laughs> it's like when you're on a plane and your ears pop. on the same saving throw? Yeah, that four? Was. That's like an insane yeah. one. I rolled double sevens, Jesus. and I'm pissed about it. <laughs> oh, well, my world, baby. Uh, can... Yeah, but I'm rolling for two characters. Right. Yeah, what's wrong? Uh, I'm gonna... All my normal fancy-looking acrobatics I try and do in my graceful fighting out the window because we're in water, so I just start, like, almost manically just... Stabbing with the spear and just stabbing <laughs> tentacles. Just going for it. Roy attack. Spears don't uh, don't uh, get disadvantage in the water, so you can just fucking. Twenty-two have at it. to hit. That hits. Woo. So I'm gonna uh, become a whaler. Yeah, <laughs> I'm harpooning the bitch. I rolled like shit damage. Uh, seven points of piercing damage. Seven points of piercing. All right. Um, and then for oh, for my bonus action. Um. Uh, um, Flurry of Blows has to be unarmed strikes, but I could do it with the spectral arms while keeping hold of my spear with the other arms. So I'll go ahead and Flurry of Blows as well. Okay. And is that at advantage, or that, is that a disadvantage or not? Because they're the spectral arms, so they wouldn't have water resistance per se. Oh, it's only ranged weapons they? that have yeah. disadvantage. Melee is okay. fine. Um, okay. Uh, no, melee is not. Melee, melee is not has fine. disadvantage. Because imagine they're water, yeah, you would still be... Yeah, unless you have a swimming speed, yeah, 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 so, um... But because they're force arms, they're like... They're not physical, they're non-corporeal. Feel free to still say with disadvantage, but have to try. <laughs> I mean, it specifies a melee weapon attack. So True. are your arms considered a melee weapon mm, attack? Well, is uh, unarmed strike a melee weapon attack? That's what, That will be the decider here. I don't think oh, so. Oh, no, because unarmed, unarmed strike, it, just, it says... It's a melee attack. Unarmed melee strikes weapon. are considered a melee weapon attack. Yeah. Oh, is it? But okay. they are not. It says, like, melee okay. weapon, melee attack. That's like, you know what I mean? Like, no, so unarmed gotcha. strikes are considered melee weapon attacks, but they are not considered attacks with a weapon. Because certain right. spells specify right. melee yeah. weapon right. attack, and like Wording. Divine Smite says attack with a weapon. Um, so it is disadvantage. Mm, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. But your spear wouldn't. Yeah, no. But, but I can't. I can't use the spear for flurry of blows. That's the thing. Yeah. But because of your arms being of the like spectral yeah. making, I'll say they negate the disadvantage. Woo! All right. Cheating. So that is. 
Um, oh! Oh, one of them misses because it's a natural two, but the other one's a natural 20. So yeah. it's like hey. they both hit. Hey. It's like double both the hit. dice. Yeah. All right. And then we'll all roll a one on the damage die. I, I so mean, true. that's all, that's what I've done almost every crit, though. So you know what? It's probably about to happen. <laughs> all right. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Uh, go okay. On. I rolled a two. Nice. Not bad. So Not that's a one. Four Twice plus could you do. four plus four. Oh, where's my unarmed strike thing? I know this. Yeah, four plus four. A few weeks. So eight eight points of force damage. Okay. My bonus action. Not too bad. Not that's too bad. my turn. Okay. Abeleth pissed. Good. Understandably, you know? And it is now its turn, I believe. Yes, it is. And I'm probably mm -hmm. fucked again, but you know, it's what it is. And it's going to look at you. <laughs> hey. And it's going to attempt to enslave you. Oh, good. Oh, good. I need you to make a wisdom <laughs> saving throw. Uh, okay. You win these. No. Come on, Laura, you win these. It literally... Literally? Started to be a nat 20, and then it rolled over to an 8, so it's a 10 total. <laughs> you are currently no! enslaved by the Aboleth. Oh, no! Um, you are under its control. You cannot take reactions, and it will communicate with you telepathically on your turn what it wants you to do. So that same, like, haze that was over uh, Brooks's eyes earlier... Takes you takes over you, Daigon, and you are completely and under its control. Dutch for you. None of us can see full, it because she's full disclosure. I also my feline agility comes back because I spent one turn doing zero movement, so I can yeah. move speedy next turn <clears throat> if I, I get told to. All right, uh, and that is going to be <laughs> its turn. Uh, for all of you, it just seems like the Aboleth kind of just sat there and chilled for a bit, didn't do much, didn't do anything. Well, that means it's my turn. It sure yeah. is, good sir. Oh, I took eight psychic damage. I need to roll concentration. Oh, for, for your hexer mark, right? For whatever. hunter's mark, yeah. That's, that's it's a uh, constitution saving throw, right? Yeah, it's just a con save, yeah. Oh, not twenty. Okay. There you go. Nice. Jesus Christ. Yeah, but now I'm gonna miss my attack. Probably. So, here we go. I. Oh well, the first thing I'm gonna do is how far can I move? If is it half? Mm -hmm. Yeah, difficult terrain, so half your move. So I can move 15 feet forward. Are you gonna? Yes. Yep. And then I'm going to shoot my bow. Mm -hmm. With disadvantage, and it's a natural one. So I'm not even gonna bother rolling again. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna go get rid of an arrow real quick. And then my boy Onu is gonna move his... Well, he has 60 feet of movement, he can get into melee, right? Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. Yeah, yeah, he can he can get to like anywhere on this on the right hand side of the thing. Okay, and then Onu is going to clobber it with his tentacles, which is. Oh. It just looks like Onu is like a part of the thing now. <laughs> it's like a like, thirteen to hit. Thirteen Sag. misses, unfortunately. Yeah. When the oh, map well. first came up, I legitimately thought the tentacle was actually part of the. No, big it's just because there's no yeah. octopus Avalanche. tokens. So I was like, oh, I, I, know, make a I freaked out. Sense. Uh, but yeah, that's that's gonna be my turn. Exactly. So Onu gets into the melee made Onu. and tries to like swat it with one of his tentacles, and unfortunately misses. Onu's still getting used to being, you know, a, a sea creature, guys. Okay, it's the first time. Should have got Onu oh, to be <clears throat> like uh, just an abolith, but shrunk down. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's not even Abolith, this is like classed as a sea monster or some shit, but like this is like yeah. as close as we I have. mean, it's very close to an Abolith. Yeah, yeah, it's close Guys. enough. Guys. It probably because it's proprietary content. Probably I only just remembered. That is copyright. I've also failed some mysterious con save, so I'm enslaved and I have some sort of disease for all I know. Who knows, man? <laughs> Fucking hell. Who knows? It's gonna be fun to find out. You've got rusty uh, so that's your go turn, Damien? Yep, that's everything. Yes. Oh, Let's wait, go. am I still within the dome? Oh, you are. You should be, yeah. It happens, at the end, it happens at the end of your turn. Yeah. So, uh, here, you get so. uh, up, up, uh, eight. Nice. I don't know why you think it's plus three, because it's been plus three for ages, but it depends on my level, so it's four. Mm -hmm. right. nice. uh, Siren is going to move up her 15 feet, which uh, brings her to about there. Uh, and it's, I mean, yeah, it's just going to try and fire away with her longbow underwater and see how well that goes. I have a 7 and a 13, so that's 7 plus 5, so that's 12. That won't do it. 
and she's mad and reveals her little snake tongue out of out of frustration and that's her turn and gets 8 temp hp 8 temp hp that's good to know we just boom boom all right uh elazrin it's your turn i'm gonna move up 15 feet just gonna like step over Kess, who just like refuses yes, to get up. Yes, I just. Oh, like no, I, I, I think I just like kind of float over Kess. Yeah, like, you like, swim like, over. Swim over. The dome like, move with the. Yeah, the dome moves with yes. me. It centers okay. on me and moves. Kess just uh, reaches up and tickles the back of me. <laughs> Stop. Dude, that, there are worse <laughs> things she could have reached up and tickled. There are worse things. It's like fucking stop. Uh, I would bonus action. Move my spiritual weapon up 20 feet. Does that put it with a melee? 5, 10, 15, 20. Yeah, just about. Uh, get an attack with it. Can I attack and move it? That's a thing, right? Yeah. Uh, you can yeah. move it and repeat the attack. Cool. And then I will. Attack, move it. It's, uh, it's not a spell. It's part of. It's like one of your like channel yeah. channel divinities or whatever the fuck, right? The dome? What? The dome. Yeah, the dome. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So many channel divinities. Uh, 14 to hit. 14 misses, unfortunately. Yeah, that's fine. And then I will, as an action, I will cast. Mm -hmm. How far away am I from it? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65. Yeah, miles. 65 miles. Uh, then I will just cast Guiding Bolt on it. Okay. Ooh. Go for it. We love a Guiding Thank Bolt. And that advantage will be really helpful considering how many things are true. That uh, is uh, a 23 to hit. That'll do it, yeah. And it will take uh, 15 points of damage. 15? As yes. you, know, you kind of like, you one hand grab the, you use your, your neck, your fucking coin of Joaquin, right? As yeah. a yeah, focus. So like with one focus, hand grab yeah. that. The other hand, you just like point towards the the um, the Aboleth, and this is like blinding beam of light shoots out, and just with like a like like arcs, and just poof, slams into the side of the thing uh, for fifteen points of damage. You said, yeah, one fire. Damn, son. All right, um, and then I gain nine temp HP. Okay, so okay. Five to a nine, and that beat my turn. Okay, very good, very good. Brooks, whose mind is his own again. What do you want to do? Uh, I mean, this guy's a bitch. Uh, I'm going to... Careful, bro. I'll enslave you again. I, this guy's a bitch. I'm going to move forward uh, 20 feet, because difficult terrain. Mm -hmm. uh, fuck, I mean... How, how far am I away from him right now? 10, 20, 30, 40, 45. 45. So even if I fucking, even if I spend a key point to dash now, uh, I'm not going to be in range of him. So I guess action, I'm going to dash. Another 20 feet. And move another 20. Okay. And bonus action, I'm going to... Uh, I'm gonna drink some rum and heal using my Amulet of the Drunkard. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so that's 44 plus 4. Were you that, like, hurt? Hurt enough. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Uh, I wasn't really keeping count when all that shit happened. Uh, well, I, I healed back to one off full and then got hit by fucking eight fucking... Yeah. Uh, Two. Don't get fucking charmed, okay? <laughs> and 14. Okay, that's cool. And yeah, it is a little bit overkill, but I don't want to use my last that's potion fine. in case I... Because mean, I mean, only I can like... heal from alcohol. Yeah, no, I wasn't like... Right. Uh, I was just curious. That's all. Take okay, uh, yeah, that's all I can fucking do. Right, do I get that's... any... Am I still in the dome? Nope, you moved 40 feet. It's 30 feet. Okay, well, yep. you moved forward, so suck my dick. 
Just, did you just move forward? Not more, fine. Yeah? That's the way it happens. Oh, yeah. uh, yes. I forget I can do that. I'm sorry, I forgot. What yeah. Um, idiot. Jax. Also me. Also um, me. I mean, shit. Uh, Jax can start moving forward as well. So he can get 15 feet forward. <clears throat> yeah. How far away is he now? Um, 65? I think. Yeah. 65? Yeah, because he's 20 feet behind you. Frick. You're 45. Uh, magic missile again, I guess. Okay. Shit rolls. Shit rolls. Nine points of force damage. Nine points of force damage. Hey man, I mean, any, any damage counts. Um, yeah. So, Jax moves up, and again, these three just like while he's walking, he channels the spell, and and these three just almost like crystal-like shaped uh, be uh, beams of light appear around him, and just good shit. <clears throat> Anything else? Nope. Right. Uh, I don't know. He's still in the dome, right? Yeah. Yes. Seven. Okay. Seven? Cool. If it's more or less than what he had previously, I can't remember. Okay. He lost it. He took psychic damage. Oh. Yes. Yay! I'm Eldritch Blasted. Don't fix what I broke. <laughs> it's like the laziest fight ever. She just like taking a nap. <laughs> I'm just lying now. down. Spell, spell, spell. 24? Literally, like, laying on her side, 24 like, hits. Pew, 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 pew. Yeah, because she didn't get up. Oh, she was rolling over to her side. She's doing, like, that lean, like, almost, like, almost sexy, like, pose, and just... Five <laughs> Just this, like, damage. low effort casual. Five force damage? <laughs> yep. Two necrotic okay. and two thunder. Okie dokie. The orange Cassidy of D&D right here. <laughs> oh, did you already... Have you taken damage at all, Belle? Nope. No, I'm not gonna fucking bother really Yeah, really don't. Nice. I got, I got max. Yeah. Okay. I'm doing great, boys. Is it a turn, Kess? Yep, that's it. Lair All right. Time. Before Daigon gets a turn, uh, it's. Time I don't want a turn. It's the fine. Lair. <laughs> um. How many of you are within sixty feet of it? Me. I think. Well, no, I think maybe not. I think sixty-five. God bless. Rex is sixty-five, so yes. Onu is though. Yeah, so Brooks and Onu. Hello. Uh, it is I'm going dying. to, as a lair action, cast Phantasmal Force on you, uh, which crafts an illusion that takes root in your mind. Uh, make an intelligence saving throw. But oh, not oh me, fuck yeah. Because he's already enslaved me. He's like, I don't no, want to for, it's for you uh, Brooks and yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, Onu. I'm very smart. I love intelligence saving throws. <gasps> Natural 20! <Okay>. Woo! <sighs> Two. The D&D Beyond Dice are rigged. Two? <laughs> <laughs> um... Brooks, you see appearing mm. in front of you, and no one else sees this. Yikes. A... Uh, large, like, tentacled monstrosity taking up a uh, ten-foot cube right in front of you. It smells. It makes sound. You can feel its body temperature. Everything. It seems so vividly real. Um... Is it? You believe that it, <laughs> it, can, it can hurt you? It, to you, it just seems as if Another enemy has just appeared right in front of you, and just like, okay. it's just like blocking your path. I'm not. Am I afraid of it, or am no. am I simply just unable to pass by it and probably? It don't is just as it? if like another creature. Spawned another creature just spawned right in front of you, and it it's you know it feels real. It you can smell it. You can feel its body heat that it's emitting. It's just as if some creature just appeared in front of you and is you know is there to defend the Abeleth and there to attack you. Okay. Cool. I'll contribute to this fight one day. <laughs> um, Today is not that day. No, 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 no. The Abeleth? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> commands you. Oh, no. Oh, boy. To use your feline agility. 
<laughs> Yo, there it is. <laughs> and how far does that does that 80. make without? And is that is that? Oh, without w without it dash. Without a dash. It's, it, it's 40. It's not an action. It's just a special ability. Okay. It does not take an action, bonus action. But if I, if you want me to move 80, then my action is dash. If you want me to move 40 with it, then it doesn't take any action. Uh, in that then. case, uh, 80 feet will bring you towards these. So, so it's going to command you to use your feline agility and your dash and whatever to get in front of these two. Okay. You can bonus action on arm strike, right? I think, do I have to attack though? Uh, no, you have to attack to first, that? but it could command her to uh, step of the wind with a key point and then still have her action to attack. Does that equal the same distance? Oh, because like, okay, step of the wind, you yes. can use dash as a bonus yeah. action. If you have, so, yeah. ability, if yeah. you have yeah, okay, so that that's what it does okay. then. So Fina, okay. okay. step up, of the wind, <laughs> would put her 80 feet in difficult yes. terrain yeah. or 150 it'll, it'll in normal. You, it'll, it'll put her where I need her to be and then you have an action. Yep, yes, I have an action now. Uh, yeah, you're just gonna. You're what gonna, a bitch! You're gonna try, it used up one of my key points and everything. What a fuck you're gonna try and jam your fucking spear into into Jack's. And I don't even have disadvantage because the spear is fine underwater. Correct. Motherfucker! Oh no! It's a natural twenty. It's a natural twenty. Oh no! Laura, you have like <laughs> all that twenty today. You are. Oh, no. But not Maybe. on the same. Not on the same. You were uh, my apprentice. <laughs> I know. <laughs> So <laughs> the he's already, he's already been punched in the face by me, so... <laughs> I'd ten anime oh, no. rather liked you. <laughs> oh, no. All right, okay, uh, so... Damage. Watch me now is when I roll max damage, too. I've been, and my trademark is roll shit damage when I crit. But here we go. Why did I say anything? What? That's an 8 <laughs> on the D8. Uh, <laughs> oh so that's, that's 16 plus... Four, that's 20 points of piercing damage. Okay. On Jax. He's not bloodied, <laughs> oh, but only no. because the dome exists. <laughs> Damn. Oh, no. Well, he's like, he's Here hurt. Laura, that wasn't like, nice. Stressing out about, oh, we're all gonna die. <laughs> Meanwhile, she didn't, little did she know, <laughs> she was gonna be the one to kill them all. <laughs> yeah. That's how she knew. That's how she knew. <laughs> oh, no. I've just moved away from that spot, and now she's <laughs> ran past me and started stabbing people. Yeah, you still have it. You're like, like, like what are you doing? <laughs> okay. Yeah. I didn't mean, yeah. know what are you doing. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, and that is action, bonus action, movement. So that is your turn. I yeah, think. That's my Dying in the dome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dying in the I, dome. I, I in the am, dome, but yeah. are you gonna give me hit points after what I just did? No, you are no longer charmed. Oh. I just oh, fucking see you, just you see you fucking stab Jax. I'm assuming there's a charm. You jam your spear into into Jax, and then you just like. As you pull your spear, immediately snap, out, you snap, snap out, of out of it. You have this moment of clarity as you can feel his broken blood, blood drip onto I'm, your hand. I'm you yeah, Dutch. Jack is looking at you with like, like a shocked face. You still like the tip of your spear, just like soaked in like Jax's blood. A single tear escapes his eye, but then floats away because we're in water. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Yeah, Dutch, I'm assuming I would have guessed that Daigon's like. He, he was going to leave you all of his electro. One of your she just ran away yeah. from it and stabbed yeah. her. If she's not charmed, baddie. it's the biggest plot twist. It's the yeah. biggest betrayal. <laughs> I tried um, to tell her she betrayed her. The Abeleth is now going to spice things up a bit. Oh, no. Ooh, he's going to put on some injury. <laughs> Some fish nets didn't. Oh, oh the fight God. that me and Duke made the same joke. <laughs> Gets the handcuffs out. <laughs> Pulls no, out it's strap. moving. Oh, it moved. abeleth has got a strap oh, he's on. Here. He's here. He's oh, here. That's not tentacle. Um, so he's ten feet away from. No. A Lazarin. How much mm -hmm. reach does he have with his? I don't like it. And he has a ten foot reach with his fucking tentacles. Nah. So Wrong. he no he he's noticing you, noticing it, noticing you, noticing it, <laughs> Lazarus. I don't know what you're talking about. It, it's a coincidence. He's noticed me in the dome. He has no idea what he's talking about. I mean, oh, he's, what? Abeleths Hello. Abeleths are they can hear your every thought, Koiba. Oh fuck, they can. <laughs> so I'm just there like So he knows oh, exactly God. who's fucking with his charm I've, effects. I've literally just gone like, oh thanks in the dome, nice. I can stop the fright and the Ab's just gone. <laughs> You can what now? Yeah, you, you can, can what? What? That um, <laughs> oh, no. me one more time. Is the dome <laughs> concentration? Nope. It's no, just up. It just exists. So Until you go it down, just, right? 
and yeah, yeah until, until I until, until I am um, incapacitated. Dead man. Uh, okay. Yeah. He's just going to multi attack and swipe at you with oh. three of his four tentacles. Oh. <laughs> the fourth one, it's saving. Yeah, not can only do three. Die. It has four tentacles, but it can only do three attacks. So no. Really no, the fourth to... one's for the orgy after. I literally uh, need to go like change and put shorts on. I'm fucking sweating. I'm so nervous right now. Okay. Uh, Twenty-one oh. to hit on the first one. Yeah. Seventeen to hit on the second one. Yeah. Uh, blah, 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 blah. fourteen to hit on the third one. Please. Sorry. Please. I put up my shield. Okay. Like, I so two shield of them hit, and then the third one, you like, yeah. Okay. Um. Hot. Eight plus four is twelve. You take twenty-two points of bludgeoning damage. Christ. Uh, I need you to make Ooh. a constitution saving throw as well. Five. Eighteen. Okay. Um, cool. Nothing happens, but you do take 22 cool. points of damage. Uh, and that's its turn. I have a I have a quick question. Hello. There's no charm effect on the Abolith, is there? No. Okay. Just didn't know if he was being controlled by his master or whatever. That'd be pretty meta. I mean, just I like, can just do it anyway. Like, and oh. charm, Abolath is like, yeah. I don't want it, Richard. <laughs> <laughs> just like, do you know what I'm doing here, lads? He was cottage core all along. There's been a, been a bit of a misunderstanding here, boys. I'm just going to go back to the plane of water. Don't mind me. Just, don't mind me. Just, just like, <laughs> yeah, goes, yeah. leaves. I love how Australian he is when Koiba does it. <laughs> yeah. You know, plane of water. Straight it counts. I'm um, off to the plane of water. Yeah, what? it's off to the fucking plane of water. Uh, Davian, yeah. it is now right beside you. It sure is. Um, <laughs> What kind of uh, actions, bonus actions, tomfoolery do I have to pull off to just drop my bow and pull out my two swords? Uh, it's an action to whip out to, to... You know, you can drop your bow for mm -hmm. free, but it's an action to... You're already at disadvantage for the boat anyways. So you use your action to whip your weapons out, but it's a free action to drop your bow to the ground. Or do, okay. Would bows um, float? I guess it would float, right? So they're kind of just like... Blah, blah, blah. It's just wood. Yeah, who knows? I, who knows? Okay, how far is uh, Onu from the man? I'm not going to do that, by the way. I'm not going to pull out my... Okay, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 40... Uh, 30, blah, 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 blah. Like within its swim speed, I'm pretty sure. 60 feet swim speed, right? Yeah. Yes, within within. All that. right. Yeah, Oni's gonna rock up and uh, take a swing and miss because Gosh. as many natural twenties as I might be able to roll. <laughs> <laughs> Did anyone who 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 benefited from that guiding bolt? By the way. Oh fucking no one! I think we it, all yeah, forgot I about think that. It, it, it oh, would have been it would have been but she here anyway, so. So I guess it's still uh, uh, doesn't does it not stay if it's not like a no it is it's just supposed to be the next roll. attack the next so attack no roll. one really claimed oh, okay. it I guess hit anyway. I guess so it yeah, fizzled out it, yeah, it would it would have been the next attack claimed or not it simply went off yeah. oh no uh, I mean no it's the next attack roll so yeah, that means like did yeah which was cast yeah yeah because attack it you use magic missile didn't you as Jax no but I mean. Yeah, like Quavo said, I've already got disadvantage, so I guess I will just try and shoot it. Yeah, I mean, sure. Fuck it. Why not? Uh... Okay, first roll is a 24. Okay, second roll. A natural one. <laughs> I love this game. <sighs> Me too, man. It's great. Yeah. Uh, all right, anything else? <laughs> Uh, God. I mean, there's no way I'm getting out of its melee without getting a tentacle up my wazoo. So Correct. I will just cower, I suppose, and stay right there. Okay. Uh, at the end of your turn, it's going to use a legendary action to twat a Lazarin with its tail. Yeah. Nice. That really pissed me off, Davy, and I'm going to hit a Lazarin. <laughs> No, it just wants a Lazarin. Oh, uh, Lazarin's Davin, the one who's ending its charge. Davin, you get your six, six on the on the. Oh, six uh, temporary. Um, yeah. I, I have eight, so I'll just keep it. You know how much you want to miss, right? Oh. 
It's a natural 20. Oh, oh I'm down. No. What the no, fuck? I go down here, dude. There's no way I don't. That dome's gone. Oh no! Well, it was nice we having you, Koi, but it's been a great 28 sessions. Yeah. Yeah. So points of damage. damage. I'm Are you down. out? Yeah, oh I'm no! Out. How, how, how are we talking? My, my max 10 HP. The max HP is 25. What mm. health were you on oh, when you took 12. That? I was on 12. Oh, so you I'm lucky fine. son of a bitch. You, I'm fine. That could have been so us. bad. Yeah, I mean, if that did, crit's really fucking... That was your, if he that did was, what? That was the roll die, by the way. Ethan, Five more you. damage? Oh, of course it no. was. Thank you, Ethan. No, you, 15. You delivered? Thank you. Ethan, 15 oh, more damage. Then this is your fault. Because we 25 under, right? <laughs> so it was on 12. So it would have been... He did 29, so it was like 10 more damage. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I'm, I'm think 37 would be what it, what it needed, yep. so eight. Yeah. Yeah. You were eight oh, away eight. From, from dying. From outright, yeah. Oh, I am. Dome's gone. Uh... All right. Dormant. Um, fuck. <laughs> what the Sirin. fuck? <laughs> I hate that. <laughs> Sirin, so Sirin, Sirin. It's closer oh, to her now. Just... Sirin's just gonna fucking stab me whilst I'm down. True. Um, you rejected my advances. Siren noticing that her bow doesn't really do much. Is she within 10 feet? No, but she is now. Is gonna cast a uh, poison spray. Which is a con save on behalf of the Aboleth. Um, which it failed. So, that is Juan D12. 11 points of poison damage, which is a uh, Aboleth man. Uh, nope. Yeah, no, 11 points of poison damage as uh, Siren kind of opens her mouth and just like spits poison directly on the on the Aboleth. That's hot. <clears throat> All right. And that is her turn. Lazarin, can I get a death save, please? Yep. Oh, boy. 15. I believe. 15. 15? Okay. okay. That's, okay. A That's, okay. A That's, That's a pass. That's a pass. That's a pass. Brooks, you have Aboleth behind uh, you, big fucking weird monster in front of you that only you can see, smell, hear, and feel. And taste. And taste. From what I remember of the spell, I'm like I'm not forced into fighting that monster. It just is real to me. Yeah. Okay. I mean, um, it is the real. The target to... rationalizes any logical outcomes from interacting with it. So if you were to walk through it walk i would through rationalize it and you're and you're like oh that's normal yeah that makes sense that makes total sense that that monster absolutely he is able to yeah pass through um, things yeah. um okay uh i mean the it's that it's so convinced of the phantasm's reality that it can even take damage from from the illusion uh a phantasm creates to appear as a creature which it did can attack you and everything like it can it can yeah. attack you and you'll feel the, the damage i think on the abolist turn uh, yeah, but it can also, it can also, um, I'm, I'm talking more like attacks opportunity. Like it could just like, because it's normal. That would, what normal, that's can not it? really what would happen. Therefore, it could just twat you as an attack opportunity. Yeah, no, it can attack. Yeah. I mean, fuck it. I'm going to take the attack really, of opportunity. Guess, there's nothing there, but to Brooks, man, there's this big fuck off tentacle monster that appeared and it's like squaring yeah. off with him, bro. Like, <laughs> Uh, I have 40 foot of movement in difficult terrain. Mm -hmm. Can I move so that I'm basically next to Davian so that I would be flanking with Onu? Yeah. And that's my full 20. Just about, yeah. Like you're going to take a swing from the... I uh, will take it. This thing's boy. eating the boy that stopped me from being charmed. Um. Okay, so I'm just going to make it like a, a tentacle swipe. Uh, 18 to hit? Yes. Uh, 14, half to 7 because you're raging, right? 14? That's disgusting. Yeah, but half to 7 because you're raging, right? Yeah, but yeah, so still seven, disgusting. 7 points of bludgeoning damage as you just get twatted by this imaginary thing that isn't even there. Oh my okay. god, imagine. Well, no, because if it's imaginary, it isn't actually that damage type, is it? It's... I guess psychic. I guess it does. Be, uh, no. 
Because you rationalize it. So I, the actual, the actual you, spell you, is you, like you ache. rationalize it, so it's bludgeoning there. Because yeah, that makes sense to you. He like hit you with tentacle. That's you know what I mean. Like, I, I get it. Um, right? So I'm gonna I think dictate the spell... that it's the okay. Area. That's fair. It, that is bludgeoning. And I know that. Don't the, fucking the argue. Past... He's giving you the stats. He's trying to oh, help you mitigate because, the damage. No, look, my argument is because Brooks will, Brooks's brain will rash, rationalize it as if he got punched. Therefore, that's the damage he. he no, gets, that's fair. Right? I wasn't arguing against it. I was just pointing out that the spell specifies for yeah. when it does damage if you're near it that it's yeah, yeah. psychic. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I mean, the human brain, powerful thing. Human brain can convince, convince women human, they're pregnant so... when they're not, and like make them go through I'm the entire human, fake pregnancy. I'm not a human, so. You're part human. Uh, according to the stat book, I'm not, but okay. Uh, I'm gonna fucking twat the aboleth. Go for it. Uh, fucking garbage cunt. Uh, eleven. <laughs> Does not hit. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> spend a key point to flurry of blows. Okay. Flurry of blow jobs. Uh, oh, fucking six, uh, nineteen. Uh, hit. nineteen hits. Yeah. So that is uh two plus five plus two. Uh, so seven, nine points of, no, sorry, uh, two plus three plus two, so seven points of bludgeoning damage. Minus one, that's three. I'm just looking Quick at the maths. battle map, and it's extra sad seeing a Lazarus' nice shiny spiritual weapon just chilling out there, yeah, and now it can't dude. do anything because the Lazarus can't mean, command it's, 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 it. No, it's you gone because nope. it's concentration. Nope, it's not. No, it's not, is it? No. It stays there for the time. I'm marking down how many turns it is. If I get back right. up, I can start using it again. Okay, very cool, very cool. Yep. Unless he dies. <laughs> nope. Yeah, then, then it would... <laughs> it stays there, it will stay there for the full minute. Because it's like... Unless it's like you, a... No, because if you die, nope. it automatically... Nope. It no, stays it doesn't. there. It doesn't do anything. It just stays there. Like it it's, it's like a, It's like it's a summoned thing. It's an independent... It doesn't do anything, it exists, okay. and then after uh, it's just there. Yeah. Fuck off. Next yeah. fucking... Strong independent spiritual Next one I'm strike. Oh. Uh, fucking 24 to hit. But it's... Uh, for nine points of bludgeoning damage. Yeah. Um. Uh, I'm gonna move. Uh, I get an extra ten foot of movement speed from flurry of blows. Is this a zine? It's a, it's a, it's a zine. So I'm just gonna move five foot back away. F no. Can I move five foot diagonally to like the other side of Davian? Like here? Yeah. Oh, just I'm just quickly, I hit a make some, uh, make some room for you. There you go. Thank you. Okay. That's my turn. Alrighty. Uh, we got Jax, who just Where's got Jack fucking right stabbed. Just got stabbed by, by Dagon. Yeah. <laughs> Does he know that Dagon is no longer charmed? I didn't mean it. Uh, make an insight check. Uh, it was just a prank, insight bro. For Jax. Mm hmm. Uh, fifteen. Yeah, he he can he could see the like real, realization hit Daigon. I, I, I probably had a bit of a like Daigon's like, like entire like demeanor clear. shifted when that happened. Oh, he's going to move diagonally towards the creature. It's all fine, he bandit. is going to um fucking um. B -b 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 -b. Mm -hmm. It's gonna use the thunder gauntlets. Okay. Underwater, we all get electrocuted. <laughs> <laughs> That's lightning, not thunder. I know, I know, I know. Yeah. I know. <laughs> Technically, uh, just glasses. <clears throat> I think that's his best melee attack. Uh, twenty-four to hit. Hits. Four. You rolling with this advantage? No, should be. Uh, fifteen. Fifteen? Does not hit, yeah. unfortunately. Bitch. Gary. Gary. Okay, that's fair. Um. Do 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 do. Um. 
he is going to then... Wait, did you just do Peppa Pig? No, I did fucking Take On Me. Oh. Do 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 Peppa Pig? I heard... He heard... Did you just do Peppa Pig? Oh, Peppa Pig! Uh, he is going to cast Hello? Sanctuary on Lazarin. Okay. Uh, okay. Any creature who targets a Lazarin with an attack or harmful spell must make a wisdom saving throw. On a failed save, they must choose a new target or lose the attack or spell. Oakley Doakley. <clears throat> Uh, and that's his bonus action done. Okay. That's his turn. Um, Abelath has one legendary action left this round. Because oh. it's a bitch. Do mm -mm -mm. it! Mm -mm -mm -mm. Do it, bitch. Fuck, mm, let's go. I mean... Let's fucking do it! Let's go! <laughs> Come it on. would, it absolutely, it's smart Don't enough Don't pussy to, out! Oh, fucking no. commit, bro! Commit! To that it needs to fucking make sure that, Koi, that, that Lazarin is dead. Yeah, it, do, If do it, it attempts to attack a Lazarin, it must make a wisdom saving throw. Yeah, but you it know has it's hard. disadvantage on um, wisdom. <laughs> wisdom ability oh checks, God. not saving throws. Oh, okay. Never mind. Oh, I hate this game, actually. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's the DC? 15. 15? Uh, 18. Okay. Okay. That's a bitch move, but okay. That's a oh. bitch move. All right, dude. Uh, Are you critting? It's crit. If it's all crit, it, it's, it's all crit, crit anyway. Anyways. Okay. Okay. So it's two death saves gone. It's just yeah, two yeah, death yeah. saves gone. Oh no! Someone so give that man fails, one pass, a juicy stat. Oh. Two yeah. fails, one pass. Okay. Just don't roll a fail on your turn, and we'll pick you up oh, easy. Yikes. Yikes! Okay. Whose turn is it next? It's now Kessa's turn. I'm gonna make him drink a healing potion. You know, he's like right, right next to him. Right next to him as well. <laughs> yeah. She's just laying next I'm to him. Gonna, I'm just gonna roll over gonna and roll like over make him just... drink a healing potion. I feel like part of me wants it to be like this really like cute intimate moment, and part of me is just imagining Kess like laying on top of him with a potion, being like, "Wake up, you motherfucker!" <laughs> yeah, pretty much. My favorite bit is like when she first uncorks it. She's like, it starts to escape a little bit. It's like, no, fuck. No. <laughs> <laughs> get back, get. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 okay. if you put the bottle into his bubble, it's not gonna... Yeah, I know, but True. it's just funny um, to think, like, so no. yeah, you take, use your action to just force a Lazarin to, to drink yeah. the healing potion. I really well, love the idea that Kess will spend this entire fight lying down, and still have <laughs> contributed, like, a <laughs> lot. <laughs> <laughs> She'll have so, saved a hey, life and dealt the most damage broke, and not got up. Is it a normal, a normal healing potion, Kess? Yeah, it's a normal one. So 2d4 plus 2? The only problem is if the Abolith gets into melee while you're laying Your down. dad yeah. is 2d4. Yeah, 2d4, so 7 plus, plus 2. It's a 9. You heal for 9 mm -hmm. hit points. You're alive! Lazarin. You're alive! You live! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! He lives! <laughs> she like, she, he like finishes the healing potion and she just kind of lamely throws the, the bottle at the Abolith. <laughs> <just away. like, laughs> and it, it just goes away. in the back of the head. It just, yeah. it, 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 it foos back up with water and just comes straight back down. Just like... <laughs> just like the uh, I mean, that's your action gone. Do you, you want to do your, uh, use your bonus action for anything? Um... Mm. Nah. Okay. I'm good. Mm, no. Who's ready for another layer action then? Um, good. Not me. Me, 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 me. Uh, no, thank you. This is democracy manifest. It is once again. Take your hand off my you penis. Financial support. Um, it's once again going to channel its anger and rage into the water around you, and I need every one of you to make a wisdom saving throw. Why is he so oh. angry? Let's say dirty, dirty twenty. twenty. Can we get dirty twenty? Okay. I failed. I rolled a five. Twenty one. Cunt. Can we get him some free therapy through uh, Rise Above the Disorder? Double cunt! <laughs> no. What's your disorder? Apple. Uh, Bro Brooks and Jack both fail. Anyone under 14? Wait, was it Wisdom? Yes. Mm -hmm. Why are you stopping? Hmm. Hargo. 
How much damage we taking? Uh, anyone, anyone that's rolled under fourteen is uh, seven points of uh, ah. psychic damage. Okay, I'm uh, very much bloodied now. Look at uh, it. Jax is officially bloodied. Gee, I wonder why. Okay. Yeah, I wonder why, huh? Laura, we'll, wonder we'll, why. We'll, we'll talk about it. We'll talk about it. <laughs> Who did that? Uh, it is now your turn, uh, Laura. Uh, okay, I'm mad. I'm real mad because he made me stab my friend. Go for it. again, just even more angry and like unhinged looking than before. Just stabbing with the spear at the nearest tentacle thing because I'm in that clump near it, right? Yeah, you're like here, so I'll move you. Okay, move well, to I, side. can I can I move to its back then, like beh like directly Wee. behind it? We like here. Can I get even more behind it? So like it would have to do a 180 to even see me. Yeah. You came from there. Wait, hold on. 5, 10, 15, 20. Yeah. Cool. cool. Get you about there. Cool. Then, yeah, I'll do that. Okay. Uh, uh, fuck. I rolled like shit. That's a 10. Uh, uh, 10 does not hit, no. All right. Well, I'm going to... I'm mad. I'm gonna spend my last key point. I'm gonna go ahead and flurry of blows, and I miss the spear, but the spectral arms are just gonna get like mad <laughs> fury flight of anger with the the claws. Fuck me! I rolled single digits for all these three, so the highest one is a fifteen to hit. It's not so. hits. God, I'm so unhinged. I mean, you rolled an extra to stab your friend, head. though. That's nice. I know, right? Like, what is this? Why? <laughs> why? Why is that the nat twenty? And I wasted my last key point. I'm upset. <clears throat> I'm upset, but oh well, at least I'm behind it, so hopefully none of those anyone it can see bullshit hits me, so. That's my turn. It's your turn? Alright. The Appleth! Oh, here we go. Is going to! Brit Alazrin again, and this time outright kill him, because he's pissed. <laughs> okay. And the really ultimate to. trade. I'm assuming he knowing the thought that I won't be having the dome back. He'll know that being the last one's mine. But that changes anything. To save my own skin a little bit. But if you fucking pissed at me, that's fair. That's... I mean, he can he read minds? He yeah, can. He, that's a Dutch he 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 every thought. He literally he hears every single thought that's going on near him. How do you know? Because the DM Cause said Because I, so. I said so. I, this is me metagaming you, Tang how Dutch. You know, how do you know he was telling the truth? Well, <laughs> it doesn't matter if he wasn't. I'm still giving Dutch the game That's knowledge he would give. Like, okay. <laughs> Damn lie, okay? The Abeleth. Kebabeleth. Is going to twat. Oh. It's going to move here. No, 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 no. Can someone get an attack of opportunity from that? Uh, would on. I? It hold looks on. like Jax would. Hold, 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 hold. I can Wow. What about me? Yeah, give me a sec, give me a sec. I'm fucking moving him, but fucking Siren's ass is in the way. Um... <laughs> Siren's fat dumpy. <laughs> Honestly, it's going to just take the attack of opportunity on the chin and it's going to fucking swim, like, here. Oh, yay! I do not like this. So, Daigon. Onu. Uh, Jax, Brooks, and Avian all get attacks of opportunity because you're right. I don't I think rolled... I can with a ranged weapon. Yeah, but you, uh, you can just uh, take it. Eh. Right? Yeah, <laughs> throw an unarmed strike. I on rolled a 21. Out. It's. Did Onu? Uh, Onu oh. can as well. Fuck yeah. me. Your attack of opportunity is when it's moving, right? When yes. it start, begins to move. I rolled yes. a fucking one. So on the I would side. still get advantage from flanking with, to cancel the disadvantage of fighting in water before Correct. it moves. Correct. Wait. Okay. Wait. Okay. Un rolled an 18. Hits. It takes five okay. points of piercing damage from my spear. I think it can't leave now. Does Onu have... I think Onu grapples it on hit. But it's a tiny little octopus. Uh, there's it a, might be does size, size space. come into thing there? It would do if the grapple size always comes into mana. Uh, it, it, I'm pretty sure with the grapple ruling specifically, so let me see. But literally, okay, here's the wording of the binding strike. Uh, the target is grappled. Escape DC equals your spell DC until this grapple ends. The beast can't use this attack on another target. But there's no... 
And when I, I hover on I grappled, would... it doesn't. It just. There's no specifics on size either. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. oh my god, do I really have to like control F fucking Holy fucking shit dude, there we go. Um... Grapple rules are always just such a pain. I mean yeah. grapple grapple checks there are size rules, but if the attacks but there's no check, it's, it's grappled, yeah, it's yeah. And then yeah, you can grapple a creature one oh, size larger. The grappling rule says targets, you know, the target of a grapple needs to be yeah, but this is, isn't version. a. It's not okay. a grapple. Uh, well, no, 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 no. no. That's that's the ruling. Effect. That's no, that's um, the ruling. If it if it's one size larger, what yeah. is, what is this thing counted as size wise? Uh, it's large, and you're medium, so technically, I think yes, large is one size up, right? Yeah, if it's larger, Ooh. then he can, if it's just large, he can grapple it. Yeah, so it's grappled, and it takes zero. one d six. Let me see, one d six plus two plus two. So one d six plus ten. Let me just roll a d six real quick. It's a five, so nine points of bludgeoning damage. Okay. Oh. Uh, and that's that's Onu's attack of opportunity. So let me just roll my unarmed strike real quick. This is oh, really wait. not worked out for the Sabalith. There's a 14, oh, so my so, punch missed. Okay. Um, uh, Brooks and Jax. Brooks's flat roll was a natural 20 for nine points of bludgeoning damage. Jax's roll with disadvantage was a 15 plus 7, so 22, uh, for uh, 8 points of thunder damage. Okay. Okay. Right. Right. Now. Oh boy. It is still going to multi-attack. Wait, it's back to its original spot in the battle map. Why is it there? That's literally the because it 15 minute discussion we just had there. <laughs> yeah. Oh. O Onu, Onu grappled it, so it can't move. For some reason, I heard the discussion, but then still pictured it as just Onu moving with it. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 hold up. I'm going to choose, even though it's grappled. I'm going to choose. Mm -hmm. When you move, you can drag or carry the... Uh, no, that's only when... Those creatures who's that's, that's, that's only as the grapple, right? Grappler. Never mind, never mind, yeah. never mind. It's just gonna fucking so, sweat you guys then, you know? Fuck yeah. it. When grappled, your speed is zero. That's do, that. do any of those well, attacks opportunity get cancelled out? Like, what was the order? Because no, if, if it was no, stopped no, from No, they, they, they all happen when it attempts. Like, within the same six okay, seconds. Okay. So. okay. Uh, instead, it's just gonna twat Onu because it's annoyed at the fucking octopus. No. It's gonna twat <laughs> Jax and it's gonna chat da the twat Davian. <laughs> Losers. Uh, yeah, so, idiot. Onu first. Uh, 19 to hit. What the fuck is Onu's AC? Yeah, okay, that hits. For 10 points of bludgeoning damage. Okay. Jax. 18 to hit. Uh, no. No? Damn. He's like, AC he's 19. like, AC's like 19, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Davian. He's fancy armor. Uh, 21 to hit. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. How hurt is Davian? Right right now? Points of not very. Damage. Okay. Like, like still not very. Okay, that's fine. And that is its turn. You're up. Who's you? Davian. Davian. Sorry, Davian. Oh, okay. There, look on the street. If you look on his, uh... Oh, no, I have my character sheet so I can see my AC, okay? Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Um, uh, alright. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm gonna just... Make a quick concentration check. Okay. Which is a natural one, so uh, Hunter's Mark is oh. no longer. Okay. So watch me actually land a fucking attack now. <laughs> um, I mean, I'm going to shoot Bo with disadvantage. Sure. That's uh, a 14. It's not hit, unfortunately. Okay. And Onu is going to attack without disadvantage. And it's a natural one. So Damn. that's really cool. Fuck. You love that for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's my turn. Alrighty. Um, Sirin 
You see, I'm just gonna poison spray again? That seems to work pretty well. Yeah, I think so. Just gonna fucking just spit poison. It's a cantrip, fuck it. Fucking go. Uh, ooh. ooh. Oh, wait, no, that's a fucking con save. It's not an attack roll, so that roll becomes the con save. Uh, Apoleth, where are you? 14. Where are you? Which is enough. So, yeah, spits poison, nothing happens. Elazrin. Okay. Buddy. Pal. Friend. Stand I stand up. I'm prone. Um, I will drink a healing potion as a bonus action. Yeah. Holy fuck. Uh, fucking plate almost fell off my fucking desk, dude, because I was shaking. <laughs> it sounded like a like a drum roll. It's sound true. effects, guys. You would know. True. Foley. <laughs> Foley work. Uh, like it's seven points of healing back. Yeah. Yeah. Heal for seven, and then if I move forward one, I'll still I won't be in melee with it, will I? I'll still be ten feet away. Or would uh, I be five feet? I'm not sure I am. Wait, wait, okay. it was here actually because it was able to hit you. So right now you're 10 feet away. So if I move up, I'll be able to maybe in melee with it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry? If I move up, will I be able to be in melee with it? It's yeah. like I've got five feet of movement left. So I'll move up to it. I'm fucking pissed. Am I flanking with anyone? Yes. The entire game <laughs> is pretty much all around it. Uh, then I will level two inflict wounds. Okay. Go on, son. That is a 22 to hit. That hits. Oh, 10 damage. Here we go. I'm, I'm straight parking right now. Big money no whammies. Come on. Big numbers. Let's go. Big numbers. Okay, it's very split down the middle. Great. Uh, <laughs> Uh, fucking mass. Uh, Twenty-four points of damage. Damn. All right. Nine to zero, and then a two and a three. That's <laughs> like. Okay. Four points. The march, and that is my turn. Okay, okay. Brooks. I mean, Angie. This guy's a bitch. I'm still flanking with Onu, right? I mean, yeah, that thing's around it, so... So... I'm gonna use my action... Okay. ...to punch it. Go on. Go on, son! Go on! Uh, that's a fucking... nine. No. Um, uh, I'm gonna use my last key point to flurry blows. Uh, the first one's a uh, fucking 17. Uh, just hits. And the second one is a 24. You roll with disadvantage? No, because I'm flanking. Straight oh, roll. true. Straight rolls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Wait, yeah, yeah. Whoa. yeah so both uh, both hit. Uh, for a total of 14 points of bludgeoning damage. Okay. That's my turn. Good. Very good. <clears throat> okay. Uh, it's not Jax's turn. Ah, no, it's Is gonna do a legendary action, action actually. Oh, oh no! Bitch. Actually, it's going to use a legendary action uh, to. I mean, it's hyper focused on the Lazarin because it has seen the potential that he has. They're just gonna yep, try and fight you again, Lazarin. Uh... Yep, cock. 17 plus... He hasn't even put his dome back up. Uh, he can't it matter. Like, it, the Abeleth is now just like... I, I know, has I know. basically run the numbers and is like the biggest threat to him as yeah, far as his yeah. knowledge goes is a Lazarin, so he wants a Lazarin gone. I mean, I do I do a bit of damage and I also have the capability to heal, so he's like, yeah. yep, cool. Uh, <laughs> Mr. Yeah. Yes. Reroll that, please. Uh, Silver Babs for Jax. Ooh, good shout. Uh, that's still a 17 to hit. Okay. 16 is my AC that hits. Uh, 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 uh,
You have advantage on your next attack roll, ability check, or saving throw. 12 cool. points of bludgeoning damage. Ooh, okay. Still Are up. you out again? No, Looks you're still up. Uh, if I didn't take that, um, Teen Potion, I would be out. Yeah, that's why. Uh, it's Jax's turn now. Jax's turn! Let's go, Jax! Uh, well, shit. Not many good things to do here. Me every turn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, underwater sucks for everyone. Not me. Uh, I'm lying down. Can Jack move into a position where he's flanking? Cass is on a lilo. <laughs> <laughs> She's just vibing. Sunglasses it's... on and a margarita. Yeah, Look, it's just making like, like gang castles on the water. Is a lilo uh, the British word for a flanking. hammock? I can't remember. No, no. it's uh, like a floats tee. It's just like oh. a air mattress. Oh, okay. Uh, uses action to attack with the thunder gauntlets. Okay. Uh, fuck me, that was nearly a natural 20. Uh, that is a 21. Hits. And then he's going to use his uh, bonus action to do weapon fighting. Okay. With the other gauntlet, that's a 24. Hits. So the first one is a 12 points of thunder damage. <clears throat> and the second one is uh, one point of thunder damage. One point of thunder damage? Because it didn't get modifiers because it's his uh, bonus action one, but I don't yeah. know if the weapons themselves have any modifiers, so we're just going to save one for now. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the first time I've hit with the gauntlets. Uh, the Abolith now has disadvantage on attack rolls against anyone other than Jax. Ooh. And that is Jax's turn. Uh, fuck. Hold on. Uh, yeah, legendary action, tentacle, Jax, in that case. Okay. <laughs> uh, 25. Ooh, yeah, that yeah. hits. Yep. Uh, 11 points of bludgeoning damage. That's spicy. Okay. Is Jax looking pretty, pretty? <clears throat> He's been pretty bloodied for a little bit. Like he, Yikes. he was bloodied before that hit. Okay. Guess. Um, I'll just blast. Never would have guessed. Ooh, twenty-four. Ooh. Ten. Four damage. Four. Oh, she's about to get the kill, isn't she? And two thunder. How do you want to finish him off? <laughs> the lazy kill, like. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> she's still gonna lie down. <laughs> she's staying lying down. <laughs> she's gonna lie down, not even look at him, and just. just yeah, yeah, not even look. Just, just shoot an eldritch blast. And He's so over this. <laughs> She's just like fucking. That's so staring stupid. At <laughs> I like to also. I like to imagine Kess's King like slightly lower and lower in the sand because it's like watery sand, so just more, more and more yeah, like yeah. covered in a hole, just like nicely by. I mean, there's no sand there. She... Like I, I gave you guys a floor, oh, okay. but oh, you're, okay. you're like floating, and the b b below you is like this star like, no ocean chasm. of like an open chasm. Oh, of, like, okay. Swirls oh. of stars and it looks very. Or even more and... fucking of a vibe, just in the fucking like it's night sky, just, just like floating. Yeah. No, She's just looking at the stars, just having a good no, I know time. It's, I know it's dead. I'm just gonna take some credit that Onu actually managed to stop it moving to probably beat the shit out of Kess. <laughs> <laughs> because <laughs> I contributed was nothing Kess else. Because they were both f uh, prone in yeah, yeah, yeah. the it would have just yeah. fucking... She was gonna misty step away after uh, um, when she got a turn again. As the Abolath is just like... It's like shakes up and down. It's like slowly floats down. And you see it sink into that chasm below. Um... And you can see it slowly, slowly disappearing. And suddenly it just, you, you see a bright flash coming from under under you. And oh the body of the Aboleth, gone. Aww. Looks like a Zelda boss. I wanted to take a tooth. But before it does that, <laughs> from its open mouth come floating up a few items. Ooh, oh, like a tear uh, of Kasuth. 
Like a heart container. Well, I say a few <laughs> items. A a uh, a a wooden, like strengthened box. Oh. It's a mimic. It's a mimic. <laughs> it's a mimic. The round two. <laughs> That's, that was the real boss. The mimic was controlling the other one. Kes just kind of like <laughs> Kes sits up and is like, "Oh shit, is dead." I hate her. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna run oh, over. I'm gonna run over to a Lazarin and just kind of make sure he's all right. You know, give him a pat on the shoulder and dust him off a little bit. And you see that Lazarin is just fucking like a bloody, looks haggard as <laughs> shit. It's just like I'm good. I like to cast cure wounds on myself. <laughs> Siren will kind of look around. Suppose that could have gone worse. Is anyone else bloodied? Evan. No. Not me. I am Dagen? still bloodied. <laughs> Jax is gonna go over to Dagon, holding the wound where he was stabbed with her spear. Oh no. <laughs> and take out his little spider and put oh, it on Dagon. What a, oh, what a- If I didn't feel bad before. <laughs> just like, if, if it's possible, I just kind of look really sheepish and almost like yeah. cuddle in on myself a bit. And I feel- and I'm like, try and like turn away and like try and clean his blood off my spear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like there is a me. hole in this man. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah, well, you know. I want to run over to the box. Uh, <laughs> you heal 13 points. Dagon. Thanks. Who you got? Hey. Remind me never to fight anything underwater ever again. <clears throat> yeah, let's. No, just... I fucking yes. hate it here. This kind of sucked. I think all I really achieved was losing four or five arrows. But you might have got the thing you came for. Yes, yeah, right. And, you know, save the Tritons and all that, but. Yeah, uh, sure. More importantly, we got what we came for. Maybe let's find out and then fuck off. Can I try and use like you know how you can when you use like a oh, like the button of a spear like open things before anyone touches it? Can I try and open the box with a spear or if, if it's locked? Can I try and like hit um, the lock off? Well, due to you being on the water, it's gonna be very hard to open open the box with the pressure. That's the water true. Actually, like that. I forgot about that. Yeah, then never mind. But you have a chance. I, you know. Well, can I sense? That the tear is in the chest or not? Um, you have a pretty, like you have a pretty good feeling that it is. Yeah. Do you want me? Do you want me to go in one of the vessels and open it in there and then come back? Mm. Uh, I'll I'll take the box, and I'll I'll take the necklace and just like. <laughs> just press the necklace against the box and just see if anything happens at all. No. Nah. No. I'll just sign to Kess. Maybe we should just take it. Like, let Fairy know we're fine, but then take the can box I... on shore and open it on shore. Mm -hmm. I don't can know. I try to, I'll just blast the box. <sighs> um, make a charisma <laughs> check. I'm about to blow the fucking tear to smithereens just somewhere mm. into the fucking ocean. Eleven. Eleven? <laughs> <sighs> You're trying, Do but uh, it seems that uh, it's just not... Does not he get, like, a little, like, glow? Like, a little bit of Eldritch pre-cum? Or is yeah, it like, yeah, like, you, you see, see like, you see, like, uh, <laughs> as the water evaporates. More. You can see oh. the two, you know, with the necklace revealed, you can see the two tears, like, light up a little bit, but it's just not enough to... It's not enough to actually. Well, let's let's pull for that. Don't worry. Hmm. Let's tell Fairy that we're <clears throat> safe and then get back to shore. I think. Let's get the fuck out. Oh yeah, I that fucking like, like thing that Brooks thought was real is also gone. Like, uh, by the way. Oh. <laughs> okay. So like... I I assumed as much. Otherwise. Yeah. Before, we're all just like chilling, and Brooks is still like, "Come here, you fucker!" Like, <laughs> going in. We're all just like, what the fuck? Somehow it becomes more Irish every time Davian does the voice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Alright. Let's get to like, just full comedy. So you guys uh, make your way up. 
Yeah. What I, were, what wait, were, before were before we before we leave, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. is there anything that looks significant in this chamber below? Like I know I know it's like a vast bottomless pit. Um, the way this kind of hmm. it, does it seem like a, like it, we're in a freaking? Did we? Are we in an interdimensional space or some you, shit? Like, how smart is Davian? Like intelligence. Fourteen <laughs> intelligence. Make an intelligence check. Oh, Ten. It seems to you that you are still on your plane of existence, right? But you've entered what seems to be a gateway, or you've entered right. a, a a sort of like passage into other planes of existences that has been hidden away on the, you know, the prime material plane. Um, so you, if you were to dive deeper down, you would probably end up in a different plane of existence. Uh, and you have Is to the guess, stars some kind of giveaway? No. Or? No. Okay. Um, if you have to hazard a guess, it'll be the elemental plane of uh, water where you'll uh, end up. So um, where's all the fire shit? We're in the seat of flame. Yeah. Long gone. Well, we've been having visions of other things. Yeah, it's just, you know, I was thinking, well, could we restore this place to its former glory? But I guess that's that would be kind of rude with the Triton still vibing over there. <laughs> but um, it seems to you that you are still in the Prime Material Plane. You're just in some kind of like weird hidden passageway that would lead to, it, for your best guess, the Immense Plane of Water, since okay. the nature of... The creature you fought and who it belonged to. In that case, so would, would there be nothing of interest and definitely not wanting to dive any deeper? Yeah, I guess I'll uh, turn around and try this back. Back in. Oh, oh no. As about oh, a minute has passed, oh, no. your skin turns translucent. <gasps> what? Your skin is translucent. What? Excuse me, but, I, but I'm, I'm me, but with translucent skin. Correct. Can oh, we see on. like we all, all her see internal this? organs? Yeah, everybody sees this. Like a jellyfish? It's, she has oh this translucent, slimy skin. Yeah. What? What? What the? Like, what? like we can see through and see her internal organs. Correct. Can we see the can rashes see she insides? has for breakfast? Pretty much. Yeah. Megan, <laughs> what the fuck? What I the... just, I just go like this, like eyes wide, so, and I just look at a, look at around. Do you feel okay? Do I feel different at all? You feel fine. I I I just signed a cast. I I feel fine, but I'm freaking out a little bit. So am I. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> uh, Lazarin, this is your wheelhouse. Have I heard of anything like this before? Make a medicine check, my boy. I win these. Uh, Nineteen. Can everybody deafen real quick? Oh, what? Yeah. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. When we when we undeafen, like have real quick, thing. just like literally, like just pay attention, yeah. just real quick. Oh boy. Deafen now. Deafen now. Okay. There we go. <laughs> you have not seen this before, right? But um, have learned, you know, you, you've, you've got some kind of medicinal training and, and whatnot uh, in your time as a cleric for Joaquin. Um, the name, you don't know if there's a name for this condition, but what you do know mm -hmm. is that basically what this means is that Daigon, Daigon's body is now conditioned to only being able to receive healing underwater. And also, she'll, as with any aquatic creature, slowly die if she leaves water. If she she can no, she cannot okay. exist outside of water at this point in time. Do I know a cure, or like how to cure it, or very or powerful healers? Okay, something not something in your capabilities. Yeah, not in my house. Cool. Oh boy. I was like, while a Lazarin's looking at me doing some examination, I just signed a Kess. I, I really think we should go back to the healer now. Their their healer. Maybe maybe uh, th maybe she knows. Yeah, I we shouldn't were. hang around here any longer. I've never, I, I know what this is. 
didn't, I didn't think it was real. Um, oh, but you can only... You're kind of like an aquatic creature now. So what you, the... You, um, you can only really be healed under water. And if you go onto land, um, you know when you take a fish out of water. Um, that's what would happen to you. You're How does I the just like there. long blinking for a minute, and then I sign the kiss. This is really ironic, considering I'm a cat. Catfish. Um, <laughs> is it curable? <laughs> cat, no. How? Jelly cats. How do we get rid of it? Um, the bad is you need a very powerful um cleric. Luckily, we've got one. Hopefully, um, you know, we're, we're fairy, but I don't. It's not a magic that I can do. It's, I don't know how powerful a cleric um, or healer uh, fairy is. So, well, what happened to Dagon to cause this to happen? I assume it's a it's, it's like a toxin, right, or some shit that usually happens to them, it or is, like some um, sort of magical. Power. Oh shit! It is like sometimes when the Abolith hits, it creates something oh like it can choose to just. In fact, it's, it's that's so fucked. Wait, wait, what if, what if none of the Triton are actually Triton? <laughs> oh my god! They don't look translucent though. Like they don't look like how my skin looks right now. They have like oh, we don't know how it might progress. Yeah, like basically, um, abolets with their power to enslave things would often also turn them into aquatic creatures so they can so they can live there and live, live, live close. Yeah, that's right. Just I don't, um, then testing it, I take off my cap of water breathing for a minute and let the bubble go away and see if I can breathe water. Uh, as a matter of fact, actually, yeah, sure, um, you have to. You start to choke. Yeah, with, with the cap on, oh, you're probably having the worst Take it off. Yeah, yeah. You start to choke. Take that shit off. That's a good point. <laughs> um, start breathing normally again. Okay, while while we go uh, to the ferry, I'm gonna go in one of the vessels and talk to Daju. Okay. So I'll be I'll be right back. Have fun. Thanks. Never returns. <laughs> I'm gonna be dead. clutching this freaking wooden box. Oh, it's pretty big. It's like, a chest. It. it's like it's a chest, not a box. It's like it's pretty. Um, it's like a treasure chest. I'm yeah. freaking <laughs> both arms around it. Onu's whole all tentacles around it. <laughs> Motherfucking like Gollum, but with a chest. <laughs> it's like, uh, it's like, a, um, I think I'm confusing two different scenes from Pirates of the Caribbean, but don't they run along the bottom of the ocean holding the dead man's chest? Ye yes, I believe it was. Yeah. Mm. Maybe. I'm not sure. It's been a while. Mm. It's been a while. But anyway, it's... yes. Okay. So you're, you're guarding the chest with your fucking life. Mm. Okay. And Onu's life. And Onu's <laughs> life. Uh, so, can you pop in the vessel? Yes, specifically Dashu's. Okay. Yes, yeah, gotta gotta be clear. <laughs> yeah. Just to clarify, is he around? Yeah. Excellent. And I, I'm, I, I look like a drowned rat, probably. <laughs> Just suddenly, not but in your water. Hair, your hair is dry, but your clothes are soaking wet. You've looked yeah. better. That's weird. Uh, how dare you? Um, <laughs> Apolith is dead. Very good. Um, okay. Uh, also, um, fucking Dagon's turning translucent. <laughs> Don't take it out of the water. Got that. Also, uh, the healer from the Trine Town wants to see your neck. You know, for the whole violent rot thing. Huh. Um. Like, like now or? Uh, we've got like an hour walk there. Uh, oh. Why? Why? Because mm. I asked about it. And. What? What do you mean, and? I'm not letting you off the hook that easily. What, like is she, what is she going to do? I don't know, see how far it is progressing and stuff like that. I'll look at you. And just kind of like... Ooh, ooh, I need you to make a persuasion check, actually. <laughs> okay. 
Dude, what is it with just people in this campaign being like, why do you care? Fuck it. Just let me, let me do dumb shit. It's let me bad. be, let it's me die. It's trauma. fine. <laughs> it's more of like, Persuasion. he's okay with it. You know what I mean? That's more what it is. Like, yeah, he's yeah. Been like, oh, he's been around for a while. He's like, oh. 14. Fine. Persuasion. Just yes. give me a, give me a shake or something. When okay. I need to uh, appear. I'll do that. And he'll like instinct right. like instinctively kind of like rub his neck now that you mentioned it, you know? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Side note, I definitely got my skills at lying from my mother. Because both you and Rosmu kinda suck at it. <laughs> Low key. Low I'm just key. saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't care, didn't ask. That's fine. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna go. <laughs> Dad of the year. <laughs> Hitting it with the fucking low key, dude. Yeah, okay. Don't care, didn't ask. Mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So you just pop out again? Yep. Okay. Uh, so well, you I'll sign, when, she, when she pops back out, I sign a kiss. Did he say anything about Who, did he uh, leave any who's advice? Who's carrying the vessel? Uh, I li I'd have given it to Daigon. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So I, I ask in sign, in sign language, none of you know. But I just ask, did he, did he say anything about this? Any advice? Uh, just not to take you out of the water. Fuck it, you suck. Yeah, I know. He was very grumpy. Yes, if you were turning into a fish. Yes. Would your Please. vessel become full of water? No. Could That's you make rough. your vessel full of water? Could I make it full of water? Like a fucking Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't think so. Could you put a swimming pool in it? <laughs> yes. So, I mean, if you can put a swimming pool in it, surely you could just have it all be full of water. Mm. The old aquarium. One giant swimming pool. I think if I was like a water elemental, then yeah, but... If you turn into a fish, would you still be an air Love elemental? Me. I mean, I'd be a fish. Well, right, but, you know, <laughs> like, dog is still a monk. I think, mm, like, how do I explain this? Okay, so the vessels are, like, an extra-dimensional thing, but they're kind of a bubble within the plane of air, you as far as me. I know. Right, but you could still put... So, so if I was to, be... like, if I was to move it into, like, the water plane, then maybe. I don't know. But you'd be an air-elemental fish. Are I we having it. this conversation while walking? Uh, this, yeah. This is like a okay. walk and talk. Okay, yeah. good. Just making sure. Wait, no, I'm, I'm very anxious to get back to the healer right now. <laughs> but since you don't need to breathe, mm -hmm. do you think you'd need to breathe as a fish? Mm, probably not. What is this conversation? <laughs> this is becoming very, do I swim? very complicated. Do I swim any better right now? Or is it just like, I'm just me as before. I just now can survive in and like look it's, like water. Yeah, but like, I'm not all of a sudden like, you know, you are just swimming around you, like a mermaid or some shit. But you're see-through and ah, you can live underwater. Build. That's so shitty. That's so dumb. You can still move like 80 feet. <laughs> That's true. What the hell are you complaining about? <laughs> yeah, but she can only move 80 feet and then stand still. And then, and then stand 80 still. Feet and then 80 feet and then stand still. Only for six <laughs> seconds. That's still pretty fucking quick. <laughs> I mean, it averages it at the same movement speed as as just not doing it, right? Like, Odu's still faster, but, you know. Yeah, and every once in a while she'll throw a fucking the other thing in there. That's fucking... Yeah. You know? Okay. Also, sign to Kess, when you think about it, I guess this is kind of what I might look like if all of me became like my spectral arms. That Because no, oh, my spectral oh. arms still have fake fur on them, so this is still not quite the same. Wait, other character, hold on. Your spectral arms have fake fur, but you don't even have real fur? Yeah, I said that. I, I said that yeah, in the, first, the very first the time I bamped them out. I, I made a point to mention they have. They do have like, fur. They have black panther-like fur with a they're faint like physical, when like, light arms, but when yeah, light yeah, yeah. hits them in a certain way. There's almost like this striped like Bengal cat pattern, but it's only like they would look black throughout most angles, or like mm. black but yet occasionally see through. But they are furred, they, so it's like the way because I choose the appearance of the arms, so the arms are a manifestation of what Daigon wants to look like. 
Anyway, where were we? So I you could it. be a fish. Mm-hmm. But you wouldn't need to breathe air or water, so you could go out of the water. Yeah, just like I can I can go in the water without a hat on. Wait. I just don't breathe. I am so... Wait, 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 wait. Incredibly confused. Dagen. Now that you, like, breathe water, and all, you know, whatever, something's changed anatomically. Can you... <laughs> can you talk now? I think about it. <laughs> well, because first of all, talking is anyway, like, physically a vibration of your vocal cords. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and it's... Who the knows muscular unless you damage try. This guy. So you'll see me pause for a minute, and I'll try, and you just hear kind of a raspy croak before I just, like, wince. A raspy, and, like, sharply, croak? Yeah, I sharply wince and, like, turn my head and, and then just, like, look down and kind of just, like, rub at my scar. And it I think that's a no. Um, eventually. Uh, oh. Elijah. If, <laughs> or not, DM. If you were a fish. Yeah. <laughs> Go on. I don't know, what would you do? And do I still do I still have all my mental capabilities? Or do I have yeah, yeah capabilities no, 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 right. right. The same situation as dying. So. What would I do? I mean, I tried to get it fixed. When he says or... that, I just lightly whack him, and then I guess I'm not a fish. I'm just or, water tiger. Or I would <laughs> water tiger? use this opportunity to explore okay, the seabed or lake. They're very bed, similar signs. As much as I could to find what's, you know, been buried underneath it, I suppose. Right. I use it for money, is what I'm saying. But then, I don't know. I, mean, I won't get it fixed. Because... I, I'm not a fan of the water. It is. Yeah, it's fucking miserable. It's cold. It's wet. It gets everywhere. At least, you know, only seems right. I I also signed a guess. Say we can't fix this <laughs> for now. A thought. Could I make the opposite of a cap? Well, not me personally, but find someone to make anti cap of water breathing. Like it's, it makes a bubble of water around my face, so I could get up and leave if I wanted to leave the lake. Hypothetically speaking. I think if there's any way you're going to find it, you're in the right place. I mean... I mean, it wouldn't be too hard. All it had to do is fill a container with water and make it so that it fits on your head without leaking. I chose sign language. <laughs> oh, I thought just... you said that. I'm <laughs> you, but with Jax and I forgot yeah. about the sign language shit. Points yeah. to stands. Whoa. Oh, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> he thinks it. He thinks it. <laughs> like, that was just a, that was Jack's thought. Hey guys, we found the next invention for Jack's. If we can't cure me, he used to invent a water mech yeah, suit, like a some reverse, apparatus. Like a reverse sand cheeks. Mm -hmm. I mean, just like a big thick diver's helmet that like is sealed and just filled with water. Yeah, right? Right? Like, yeah. Just a reverse sandy cheeks from SpongeBob. Yeah. yeah. It's like you know SpongeBob when he goes into I'll the fucking dome. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, Alright, Jax. Don't pretend I've never seen fucking Spongebob before, Koiba. I'll fuck him. <laughs> back to the, back to the <laughs> healer. You're here in three weeks, bro. I can actually fuck you up. Four. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This man's just in the wrong train when I get there. Just like, hey, that's a train to get, mate. Like, okay. I'm fucking halfway across the country later. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Oops. Oh, no, wait. No, no. Um, okay. You eventually, uh, you know, as you're talking about... The uh, circumstance. Life is a fish. If you were a fish, um, <laughs> make your way to fairy the who is kind of like anxiously, kind of like swimming back and forth, like pacing but swimmingly. Um, swim, swimmingly, 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 swimming, pacing while swimming. But it's uh, going swimming. But it's going swimmingly. Uh, you can kind of see her like gasp out this like breath of relief as she sees you approach and then her eyes like lock on to Daigon and she's like mm. oh no yes yes, yes. Mm -hmm. don't suppose you know how to um ow <laughs> <laughs> I um I do um, <gasps> but it um hold up give me a quick hold up wait, wait a second <laughs> quick second <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. 
while, while they're thinking, also look back, if I touch people, like, say I just, like, gently poked guests, does my skin feel weird and squishy? It's like slimy. Water. Yeah. I, I actually think it because I think Dutch mentioned he, he used the word yeah, slimy. Yeah, like slimy. I guess I have this, like, yeah. Ugh. I, um, I have the ability to, but, um, I, 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 um, hold on, just, um, could you take a seat? I sit mm. down, cross-legged. And she casts heal. Uh, like the proper, the, the, the proper like spell level heal, heal yeah. on you. And you slowly see your skin turning back to normal. And I grab my cap of water say, breathing as it's happening. <laughs> you're, you're gonna, you kind of need, you kind of need air again yep. to breathe. Yep, yep. And as she's done casting it, she kind of like stumbles a bit like, oh. Okay, that should do the trick. That was an excellent moment for your camera to like adjust focus, by the way. Yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, as you stumbled, your your focus like <laughs> it worked. Oh, it's and very, then came back. very meta theatrical. Um, <laughs> yeah, she stumbles a bit, but uh, manages oh, to collect herself. All right. Um. So I'm I'm assuming by your return that you're successful. You were successful. Yeah, it's dead. So honestly, I have no idea how. The town's going to respond to us returning, so... Do you, mm, oh. do, we, do you want to see my dad here, or, like, back at the town? We could, um, well, maybe... Just in case... The... You know, freeing them from the mind control or whatever has a... The opposite effect of what we're hoping, maybe arriving with... Yeah, that would be good. Right? That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. I shake so, the vessel. <laughs> as you shake the vessel, it's like plume of blue <laughs> smoke appears, and there Dashu stands, is like, yay, f fucking ten foot tall, luscious locks, uh, fine silk clothing, two scimitars kind of like uh, hanging from his uh, from his belt, um, and then it's like this like similar skin color to to Kes. Hello, again. Dashu, very very Dashu. Fairy like looks up and is like, "Am I?" Um, <laughs> <laughs> she's a bit like, "I mean, this is a big deal, right?" Mm, so, so, um, anything I should know? What's the plan here? Why, uh, why are we not in the town? Can you open uh, this box? <laughs> Me? I'm just holding up the locked chest. Yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> and he just like, did you give it to him? Yeah. Just, just br breaks off the the lid and. Oh no! Immediately, it. snatches out whatever's inside. Um. Okay. What you find is a gold ring set with mm -hmm. bloodstones, worth two hundred and fifty gold pieces. A. Gold birdcage with electrum filigree, also worth 250 gold pieces. Oh no. oh no. These items are straight from the fucking treasure hoard table, dude, and it's. Just, listen. <laughs> uh, a brass mug with a jade inlay, also worth 250 gold pieces. A what set. I mean. Huh? I was just gonna say, I mean. This is just pirate swag, dude. We shouldn't sell this. We should put it all on for the pirate adventure. <laughs> yeah, sure, right. A find uh, someone to bury it. set of turquoise animal figurines worth 250 gold pieces. A large gold bracelet worth 250 gold pieces. A carved ivory statuette of a gorilla worth 250 gold pieces. As well as a glass jar, roughly three inches in diameter. Uh, containing a thick mixture that, um, if you open it, kind of smells of, of uh, aloe. Uh, a jar has a cloth which is now completely soaked, wrapped over the lid, and it's tied down with, like, a little rope. Um, and you also find a very small metal container, seemingly watertight. Uh, and... Did I mention the Turkish already? Because you do find that as well. 
we have not watched. Imagine as, shit. as the chest is ripped open and all of these valuables tumble out, mm-hmm. Ona reaches a single tentacle and snags the Tiraka tooth and immediately just scurries back to me as the rest sort of settles on the on the lake floor. Okay. And I can eat. I guess I'll go and pick up everything and put it back in the chest. Yeah, right. and then and then just take the chest with us. <laughs> just like I, just, I like I, I guess you. Does I the know you um, the tear, but I'll look at does the glass jar mm-hmm. seem anything like the uh, healing salve that I have? Um, what do you have again? What is it called? Let me see the definite. Okay. Oh god, uh, it is. Restorative ointment. Um, let me quickly. What does restorative ointment do exactly again? Uh, you roll a number of charges. It heals. It takes an action, and I think it heals one d eight. Okay. Two d eight plus two. Uh, it's similar. Uh, it. It's no. It's. It's called restorative ointments, you said? Yep, yep. Because I here have uh, Ketum's ointments, which does the exact same thing. Oh, okay. So. Same thing, different name. Same item, different name. Uh, 2d8 plus 2, you said, right? Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, cures diseases, cures poisoned, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's the same fucking thing. Nice. I guess it's SRD versus official. Yeah, I guess, I guess so, I guess so. Ah, whatever. Um, so yeah, it's the same. It's the same shit. It's a jar of that. Nice. Fuck it. Okay. I, as I'm putting <laughs> the stuff back in the chest, uh, I'll cast detect magic. Is any of it magical? Uh, the glass jar of ointment, and yep. you can sense magic coming from the the water type metal box as well. And obviously. The fucking tear that Oni was like. Yeah, I mean the tear, the tear. It's like (laughs) ignoring that thing that's going behind all the other things. Like the 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 treasure is all very mundane, but the 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 small metal box and the glass jar are magical. My box isn't lead, right? Because I've always been able to tell if there's anything in it coming. Uh, it's not lead. No, it's just it's just a it's just a watertight metal box so that whatever's inside doesn't get fucked by water. What what type of magic's coming from the metal box? Mother of a fuck! No one else. <laughs> gonna... The magic kind. It's fine. Magicy magic. Um, just as long as it's not the classic. Smells of magic. Ah oh, yes, I'm getting a scent of top notes of um magic. I heard as long as it's not with undertones of arcane. It is. It is. It is illusion. Ooh, interesting. That's very interesting. That's it's the... not actually a chest. No, it's coming. Well, from it's just a little box. metal. Li- it's coming from uh, inside metal. the little box, yeah. Lockbox, I guess, or just I mean, yeah. literally just like a watertight little, like literally, think like like a small little like makeup thingy, like f- whatever you know, shitty thingy yeah. that is just yeah, watertight. Yeah, yeah. It's like it's like this thin. This <laughs> like 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 this big yeah. and it's just watertight. Little. Right. Yeah, I just kinda of put everything into the chest and Yeah, just kinda of like stare. Like I'm I like gonna pick be... up the little mailbox is kinda of staring at like what the f- While Elijah's figuring that shit out, I'm just over like like freaking Frodo when he's gonna put the ring on for the first time. Like I just have the tear of Kasuth and the two tears and I'm just just bring them together and boop and see what happens. Do this underwater? You're fucking maniac. <laughs> <laughs> okay. As you do this, um, the... Oh boy. Okay. The oh, tear no. <laughs> connects. And you can see where previously you saw these, like, markings to identify that these were three separate things. They now all mold to one. And its form shifts into a proper, like, large red tear. Uh, that still hangs from your necklace, I believe it was. Yeah. You feel this, like, just, like, sense of energy surging through your body from your tippy toes all the way up to the to your scalp. 
it, it's a little overwhelming. And uh, make a constitution saving throw. Yes, chef. Nine. You pass out. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. You faint. He's gone. Oh, Does his hat stay on? Huh? Yeah, yeah. Does, Does it hat stay on? on? Yeah, yeah. He just like, he faints. He's not unconscious. Uh, he's unconscious, but he's not like, you know, I mean, he just faints. Oh, just, yeah. fucking. fucking Carry the bit. And, like, he's, gone, like, he's put his necklace on and just gone. <laughs> it would have been, you know, unlimited like a cool flash power. And a glow and, like my no, eyes no, lit no, up, and then I'm no, just, I just like, like to think that it's all in your brain, like because you're getting visions. And it's just like <laughs> we just see you put together and you're flopped. <laughs> like so, you know, it's, it's just pre syncope. You know I know that one scene in the Matrix where yeah. <laughs> and Switch and die. I was like, she just turns around and goes, no, and goes. I, exactly I mean, I immediately there. go over to this man who has just gone fucking limp. <laughs> <laughs> Does he often do is that? He... I assume he's no, still. Um... I see he's still breathing, right? Yeah, he's not just fucking dying. He's just. Davian. Davian. I think he's, <laughs> he, he doesn't really do that very often, but I think he's fine. Well, I will keep an eye on him, I suppose, and I'll kind of, as much as you can, underwater. Put him onto my shoulder. Well, uh, Ono, Ono will, will, oh, I you. guess, I'm like, like, ra if he if he wraps like a t two tentacles right. around each of my limbs mm -hmm. and like suspend me underneath him, I guess he wouldn't be able to swim. He'd need tentacles. Every time he swim. swims, just. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I was thinking like if Onu held me like kind of like a stretcher and then you could just float along. No, I'll just I'll just I'll just pick you up. Like... Well Onu will help you out, it's whatever. Yeah. Okay. Um I so you will just gonna say Um let's make our way to town and we'll we'll give him yeah. a room to, to you know to, to lay down at least. Um and I mean we should talk to Kuzus, probably. We uh we brought you out now, Dashu, just to answer your question for like extra extra diplomatic immunity in case they kind of have gone crazy after the Abolith died and freed their minds, you know. Okay. Did we? Yes. Okay. <laughs> well, I just signed a guess. He was he was literally standing right there when like yeah. Harry suggested it. Is he stupid? <laughs> Probably. I mean, he blew himself up. So yeah, for sure. I will be honest, I'm still thinking about whatever the fuck happened back there. Nah, it's fine. Um, as you kind of like head towards the town, uh, you make your way to the uh, clinic and put uh, Davian down uh, to lay down for a bit. Um, and I'm going to assume that Onu doesn't leave his side. Yeah. Um, and as you get back, like to the main lobby, you can already see that, like, as you while you were inside the clinic, Kuzus and a handful of guards are also in there now. Um, and he looks at Fairy Yi and and tells her to basically, you know, get into her office. Um, and Kuzus then looks at all of you, looking very intense. Oh, but as soon as he's ready to speak, his demeanor shifts. I, um, I, 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 I don't remember the last time my thoughts were my own. I don't know what you've had to do to make this happen, but I'm very grateful. You've freed us from Istisha's grip and that is a debt we um, will never be able to repay with that there are a couple of issues though or potential issues I should say now that we are no longer under Istisha's control and you having done what you've done I'm not sure what it is Killed an Abolith. Right. <coughs> we are not safe here. You will retaliate, um, as you are, you know, your, your father is here and has worked with him before, can, can, can probably 
agree with me that uh, he will retaliate. And Dashu kind of like looks at him, uh, looks at you all, and well, Freddy has a point. Yeah, that's what I figured. But I do have. You know, don't think in problems. We think in solutions, right? <sighs> I can transport you, all of you, out of here to a different lake where you can live, build a new community. Um, the thing is, wherever there's water, there is a stitcher, right? But that is a problem that we collectively are working on. Uh, we've got some meetings planned, a lot of boring... Um, but That's not too boring. Politician stuff, you know, we've got meetings planned, uh, I, I believe uh, your friend upstairs, uh, you know, his uh, fiery buddy, uh, we're, we're all kind of getting together, we just have to reach out to one more individual, but we'll do that in due time. There is a meeting planned, and we are all collectively kind of sick of vestitious shit, if you don't mind me uh, being upfront about it. So that is something that we'll take care of. In the meantime... All I can really do is provide you safe passage to a different lake so that when his vengeance comes to Lake Udina, you're all safe. And, well, from there, hopefully we'll be able to uh, make it so that he is no longer in a position to retaliate by the time he reaches or figures out what lake you reside in. And Kuzus kind of looks at him and looks at you. I mean, it's the only chance we have, really. If we stay here, we're, we're all fucked. Um, and Dashu will kind of give me um, a few minutes to prepare things, and I'll um, also like kind of direct to you now, uh, to, to you as a group. Um, if you have other business to discuss and whatnot, uh, I'll... Uh, I'll remain here uh, for a few hours to make sure that these people get transported to safety and then, you know, I can just dip out whenever I want to. Um, I'll, I'll make sure that, that happens. All right. Yes. Anything else you need me for? Yes, it, those meetings you're going to have, if you get the <coughs> minutes of them at any point, I'd love to read them. <laughs> <laughs> No. Fair <laughs> Sorry, it's like it's a closed group, you know, elemental oh, things, and unfortunately, you are. That's because you know, you, mine's you not the secrets. You know what I mean? You understand? Oh no, no, yes, yes, yeah, no. I totally, I exactly. could, You know one day, uh, Sorry, I, I feel bad for asking. You know, I should. It's not every day you get to have that. Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's the intrigue of a different society. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's what likes his, polit his political political yeah. histories, dude. <laughs> <laughs> and this is fucking history in the making. <laughs> true, true, true. Uh, fuck. Um, uh, nah, we just very the next thing. Oh, right, right, right. Um, Kuzus, what no. was it? And Kuzus kind of nods. Just um, just leave for a bit. I'll I'll come look for you in in a few minutes, and we'll we'll talk about things and where I'm gonna be sending you. I just I need to protective daughter and whatnot. I need to take care of something. <laughs> <clears throat> and they all kind of leave. Kuzus one more time like thanks you all for for freeing him in particular from this uh, nasty um, grip that Istish has had on him for fuck knows how long, really. Um. And they all leave. And um, Dash, you kind of looks at you, Kes. Alright, let's get it over with. <laughs> I don't like going to the doctor. Is that why <laughs> you didn't tell me at all? Man. Well, no, that is not why, but it's just... I... It's not the conversation I want to have in front of all of your friends. Okay. I signed to Kes, we can leave. We can give you <laughs> privacy. Nah, it's fine. I'll talk about it later. We gotta go up to the office anyway. All right. Sure. 
Uh, okay, so Cass, you accompany him. The rest of you kind of wait around yeah. the lobby. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Can everybody deafen real quick besides Belle? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I did not anticipate that. that. As you kind of like head towards the um, like door, Dash, you kind of stops in his tracks. Just um, wondering one thing. Mm hmm. I've not been your father at all. Mm hmm. I've been absent, and it is a mistake I made that I'm trying to make up for now, but... I can't help but think, why do you take it so personally, this, this, this affliction of mine? Well, for one thing, I feel like it's kind of a cop-out if you just, like, died. After coming to find me for... after a hundred or so years or whatever. Like, that just feels... Um, I'm not letting you go that easily. So it's not that you care about me, it's more that it's, it's like a spite thing. No, uh, somewhat. Can't even die on my own terms, is that... Is that <laughs> no. That's I'm bullshit. Old. I'm very old. Mm -hmm. I kind of made my peace with it. No, I have not. He looks at you. And you can see part of him wants to disagree with you, but another part <laughs> is like... You know... You can see like a, some some tears kind of like well up, and he kind of like forces him down. He's like, "Very well, I'll uh, don't get your hopes up, though." Mm. Oh, just so you know, Rasmu knows about it. You fucker. <laughs> well, I mean, I had to find him somehow. You said you were fine, so I told him about it, and then he said you were fine, and obviously I didn't believe that. So, so you I asked him. Snitched on me to my. You told my dad on me? Yeah. Kind of. <laughs> you are so much like your mother. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's get it over with. And uh, you both step into the office where Ferry is and Dash, you kind of like sits down, but he's, he's fucking tall. He like sits down and he's still like, you know very very high above everybody else here and and fairy has to kind of like swim up to reach his neck she kind of <clears throat> performs some 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 light incantations um well the good news is is that um even though it's surfaced it is not spread yet the um bad news is is that there is no known cure so like as far as well, how adventurous are you feeling? I'm always down for adventure. That's how I got here. <laughs> when you mentioned it the other day, I did some research myself and, um, your, well, if your father is Dashu, then your grandfather is Rosmo the Fair, right? Yeah. <laughs> there is a flower that grows on the or in the uh, elemental plane of air. Well, it used to grow. It went extinct. Um, several centuries ago but there's theories your grandfather will be old enough to know what flower I'm talking about ask him about the white petal orchid there is a chance that if you manage to track down that flower that a cure can be fashioned for this affliction it is just I you know last time that plant was known to exist and not be extinct was several centuries ago so I don't want to give you hope but who knows the white petal orchid orchid yes okay 
Dashu kind of like looks at her. Oh, that's a... So my chances of survival fully depend on the existence of a extinct flower. It's good to know. Are we done? Yeah, I think so. Good. Thank you, Doctor, for your help. I'll uh, make sure to um, find your leader and, and get to find a way to get you all out of here before Estisha can uh, throw a hissy fit and, I don't know, pff, drain the lake if it's the water or something, which is probably something it would do. That sounds like it would take a while, though. Mm, a few minutes. No. Yeah. Well, you've that's seen not good. you've seen the entry point into the elemental plane of. Imagine True. imagine the lake like a bathtub, right? Mm -hmm. And that giant chasm you were in mm -hmm. is the is the plug. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Move oh, fast. Quick. It's pretty quick. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Mm. Okay. I'll go back to my friends. So you reunite with your friends, Dashu walks past everyone and goes outside. Oh boy. Oh boy. Be... So you guys all catch Dashu as he like walks past and he's going to look for Kuzus and figure out this like the evacuation thing. How does Dashu look as he le left? He uh, just... A little frustrated, maybe. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna... Give him about a minute head start, so I'm not directly following him out. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just gonna go out and sort of sit by the entrance. Okay. As much as one can sit in water. Like a cigarette, mm -hmm. but forget you're underwater. <laughs> <laughs> you could probably smoke it if you kept it in the bubble. And then you take your And then you give yourself carbon monoxide poisoning. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> How to kill no, yourself no, you have to like, one. you have to to blow the smoke out into the water. Yeah, but you're suddenly oh, yeah, burning sure the cigarette inside the bubble. Yeah, yeah, it's it's going to burn all of the oxygen in there. Like a fire consumes oxygen. It's basically That's like, a, it's like a speed run. Just make sure that you smoke It's quick. magic. It's <laughs> not science. There's not limited oxygen in the bubble. Uh... Any magic, you know, magic. magic is science that just hasn't really found, you know, they've, they've not been able to apply okay. magic to it. Okay, sure. if, if I light a fire within the bubble, is my oxygen going to run out faster? No, are you a fast smoker? <laughs> or are you a fan? You know, I mean, we all know that's I, not I true. mean, <laughs> Brooks isn't smoking anyway. Speed that <laughs> Brooks isn't smoking anyway. He's <laughs> sitting outside. Right. Um, cool. So you kind of sit outside, um... Everyone, you're tired. You've only been awake for a couple hours, mm -hmm. but you are fucking knackered. Um, it's also even just thing. running, like walking just, around, swimming around. It's like doing cardio all day because mm -hmm. you're through water. Mm -hmm. The resistance I mean, also, it's like also strength like, training. We had to wake up early. We, I got to nap, <laughs> idiots. <laughs> um, so is there anything you wish to do okay. before I cut to Davian and probably end the session there for today? Um. Uh, hmm. Level up. I wanna, what the fuck I like to I, do? I wanna. Well, I wanna find something to give to the healer as a thanks for making me no longer a catfish. But I don't think I have anything <laughs> that you should ask want. someone. Um. <clears throat> actually, I know what I'm gonna do. Ask um Kess if she could, if she would mind, wouldn't mind translating for me quickly to fairy. Okay. Yeah. Um, and. I say, I don't know how useful, like, how often you need ingredients from outside of the lake to do your healing. I don't really have a lot, and I know that m money's not really that useful to you down here, I don't think. I'd like to give you something for fixing my my weird disease. Would you have any use for this? And I take out, I still have, because I took and killed them, a vial of hill giant blood. And just be like, is there any chance this has medicinal properties? And explain to her what it is. Well, through Kes. Yeah, yeah. I... It's a bottle of hill giant blood? A, a, a vial. Yeah, not oh, a, yeah. a bottle, but it's... Well, it's not healing, but uh, reinforcement. Um, you know, making people feel a little stronger than they normally are. Um, yeah, I could make something with this. 
Uh, but you don't, you, you don't have to, though. Like, it's, you've I saved us, it. after all. I just push it further forward, and implying, like, but I want to. She's not going to okay. take no for answer. You might as well take it. <laughs> well, thank you very much. I uh, appreciate it. And thank you all for being, you know, the people we needed. We are finally able to live our own lives without being used as pawns in someone else's plans, really. Yeah, we did it. Be helpful. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> Glad um, If you want to you. get get some sleep before you leave, you know, there's rooms upstairs. Uh, you look like you oh, all, just... some of you look like you've took quite a beating. I go upstairs, still fucking looking like <laughs> shit. It's like one yes. massive black eye, bruised ribs. Oh, like, like a fucking <laughs> blonde. Like I've, as I'm going upstairs, I'm kind of like mending what I can of like what's just been like tad to shit from like water <laughs> damage as well. Just to, like, <laughs> God. yeah. I'm gonna lie down as much as I can, relax on the water. So all of you eventually go for a long rest. Um, yep. Davian, I would like everyone else to deafen besides Duke. Oh, oh good. Boy. Okay. Hello. Hello. As you were passed out, mm -hmm. you awaken in front of this large mountain that you've seen in your dreams for a long time now. You look to your arms and your legs and you feel different. And there's a small body of like a small puddle near you and you look into it and you see a reflection. You can see your eyes have gotten this like orange glow to him. And your hair kind of the part of the hair that comes from like under the hood. There's some like orangey uh, like streaks almost in him, but not they're not stationary. It's almost like, you know, like the Ember effect from Dark Souls 3. Yes, it's like that. Right. It's like that. Like an orangey red fire. Like a flickering sort of yes. fire. Yes. Um And then you suddenly hear a voice coming from um beside you, and I really hope that this is the right one. I always make this mistake, but uh, here we go. So you did it. I I I suppose I did. Now this is where the real challenge begins. Oh, fuck. You've passed the test. I bestow upon you my powers in exchange for your assistance. You and I are connected now. Partners. You are my envelope on the material plane. I'm sure you're well aware of the political moves between the elementals. Of what you so. Decision. Yes. You and your friends have no part to play in that. Don't worry. Until then, get to know your powers. I'll be in touch. All right. I shall. I'll. I'll, I'll I suppose I'll wait further instruction. And he nods, and um, as he kind of like disappears, he you wake up. But what if you, what, it feels for you as if you've only been out for a few minutes, but like you wake up in the middle of the night, you can see Elazarin sleeping beside you uh, in the room. Um, or like middle, I'm not middle of the night. Like early evening, I guess, is when you wake up due to the you know timey wimey. Yeah, weird we, we start early in the morning. Yeah. yeah, you're still fucking exhausted, but you just have like this moment of like waking up, uh, but definitely able to just like go back to sleep. But you, uh, you feel strong. You feel this energy coursing through you that it, it definitely is something that you have to learn to master and learn to tame almost. Um, and as you kind of look at like the ref your reflection in one of the windows of this uh, structure, uh, like the, re the reflection that comes off of uh, with the, um, the the light of the outside, like lighting of the streets, 
that like fiery effect it seems permanent there's like this like fiery embery glow to your hair and your eyes are not like fully brightly orange but there's like this you to them like if you look at them in the right lighting there's like this orange like shine to so them. is there like light coming off me or is it just no. kind of okay interesting um you notice that the tear around your neck um you can feel it just trembling with power medallion told me yeah literally yeah um and it's just yeah i mean shit you're gonna have to learn how to control and understand better and and learn how to use them as you go and with that you're still knackered you're beat uh so the 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 fact that you kind of you know you kind of have the feeling of like you wake up and you're like fuck it's morning fuck it's morning and you look at your alarm and you have like a few more hours to go before you actually have to be up it's like that kind you're of a like, great oh. feeling mm. yeah you're like oh fuck yeah and you just go back to lay down mm. quickly on devon everybody Game so I do get a long rest still. So. With that, you all, yeah, yeah, you get a long rest. Um, you cool. all long rest, Ooh, wake up the next morning, and that's where we'll pick it up next week, as you are now level five. Yay! Hey, we roll HP now? Or? Yeah, you can roll HP now. Oh, oh yeah. I need to decide what I'm going into real uh, quick. And that does mean, Ethan, slash Bell, I forget which one hit the stat blocks. I would like you guys to update those for next week. So that that's me. Yeah. That'd be great. Uh, which means everyone... Like, everyone needs to tell me if they have any stat yep. changes. Yeah. Uh, and, and like, I seven. If you could all DM me oh. on your HP values. Yay, I did what I always do on a high HP. I rolled pretty fucking low. I rolled a three. Three HP for <laughs> Cobra. Uh, what did you roll, uh, Laura? A seven? Seven on my D. Bell? Both uh, I don't know yet. I haven't rolled. Uh. <laughs> I'm still under 30 HP. Jesus. I have access to Stunning Strike now. Ooh. Third level spells, baby. Third oh, level no. spells. I got a five on my D8. Five. <laughs> five. Once I get a diamond. Uh, yeah, well, obviously we'll let Soko roll for his own, but we'll do that. Uh, we'll do that. I'll, you know, he has to do that at some point throughout the week. What did you roll for your health, Duke? A two on my D8. Oh, no. <laughs> Rip. Bell? Five. Five. All right. And with that... We'll uh, see y'all next week for, uh, I mean, you did it. You've secured the final tier. You freed oh, yeah. the Triton of the Lake from the grasp of of, of a bit of a dickish. Um, like, I mean, tyrant, let's be fucking real. Yeah. The way Asisha rules is uh, not necessarily in a nice, a nice way. And set in motion a pretty big, like, political change when it comes to the politics between the elemental planes, which... You all definitely have not heard the last of, given that there are so many, like, connections to those planes within the party. Um, for now, your next course of business will probably be returning to Aldilon and figuring out what you want to do next. There's a couple of things on the docket of things that you could well, do. We, as I say, whatever we have time for before becoming pirates, we agreed to that, so. Uh, yeah, I feel like pirates is the only thing that's, like, time-constrained, really. Yeah. I guess. <laughs> We're gonna have to figure out this. Uh, yeah, we do. We'll uh, we'll have a sit down for that this week somewhere. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Yo, sure. I finally get slow fall. Um. Okay. Dope. We'll probably do like one big Where's... travel sesh next week. So I need to make sure that the guests knows that next week's not the week, but the week after probably. And, um, <laughs> make sure that because we're gonna have a Maybe. guest soonish. Ooh la la. Maybe um, unless of course we go uh, deal yeah. with some. No, nah, but even then, I basically made it so that whatever you guys end up doing, like, guest is happening. It's just we're gonna have to fine tune some things. <laughs> it would be great if the if what I think you were gonna do next is what's happening next, because that would be fitting very well. But we'll see. We'll tackle that bridge when we get to it. Mm -hmm. Yay! Oh, I'm gonna, I'm Laura, you got extra attack now. I do have extra attack now. Thanks for watching, everybody. Appreciate you. Yay! We were back. We're back. Now. We're back here next week, baby. Next Sunday. Uh, no discourse this week because it's a national holiday over here. And I'm getting drunk. But there oh, will be a like blood hunt stream. But, um, oh no, that's the day before. The day before is blood hunt stream. Yeah. Yeah, the day before is also a national holiday. So, because <laughs> blood hunt comes out, is that the national holiday? <laughs> <laughs> no, blood hunt oh, yeah, comes oh, out yeah, on yeah, Day, yeah, right? right? Yeah, the day. Yeah, right. Okay. The day after, you're just fucking recovering. Yeah, and I'll have people over as well. <laughs> Um, thanks for watching, everybody. Take care.
Have a great fucking uh, week. And we'll catch you guys next Sunday for uh, session 29. Peace out, everybody. Woo! Bye bye. 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 <laughs> My desk stroke got hijacked by a cat for the last time. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Bomb, bomb, bomb. bomb. Do -do 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 -do. And now slowly, like, fade out. Just like. Bum, bum.